tonight for this season tonight what we're going to be doing is all the games we're going to be simulating and our young players we're looking to build the young players simulate the season and play only the cup games FA Cup the League Cup we're going to be playing with our youth players and the and the prim, and the premiership we're going to have simulated thank you for joining us we'll be simulating let me just make sure i share this out before i start as well so i don't i have a crazy gang join us as well let's see So let's simulate the season through. Back a second. Let's get the squad before we start. We go. Gomez is not captain. Let's change that over. Okay, let's look at the squad now. Get some of our players in. Good evening. Let's get some changes in this side straight away. Okay, Vincent is in. Legal Armada, um, good some comments, okay. Walk on the bench. Yeah, Fergus is a good player, boy. Fergus was a good signing. And put him. Sure, it was good though, he's alright. Drop the shirt, yeah. Okay. I'm home. Right. Let's see who's in the room. I'm talking. Favorite soccer team? Hmm. Well, would have been Arsenal when Henri was playing in it. But uh, I don't, my favorite soccer team were the ones I managed because at least they win things. Okay, let's see now. I think that's fair enough. Just check the office beforehand before there's anyone I've got to talk to. Let's check and see. Good. Players are getting loaned out. Let's 
simulate this game. Let's get the win and let's get on with the season. Good start, Rodrigo. Sincio and Rod came on and played. Jesus wasn't used. Good. Well done. So oh, the only games I'm going to be doing tonight will be I'm going to simulate the rest of the season. Now let's see what we've got here. Let's try and improve these young players, man. Forget these other players. I'm um, youth players. Let's see. Yeah, he's six million. We'll work on him. Yeah. All our young players we're going to improve on now. Two point eight million. Yeah, let's give him training. Janssen to get more training. Yeah, Cruz is the other one. To adjust. It's all about improving these young players, creating world class players, and Shiller misses out. We'll have to rotate. Make sure he gets a game as well. See what the office says. Got to keep talking to our players. All important. Player chat. Yep. Stay grounded, buddy. Get your rug inside as well. Um, Good evening, Prince. How we doing? Where have you been? Gone missing, mate. I haven't seen you for a while. Hope you're good. Um, so I'm simming all these games. I'm simming these games now, so... You know, as people start coming over my... Well... Just simming the matches. And improving the youth players. So I really interested the games I'm playing the FA Cup, League Cup, Champions League. Come on, let's see what other players played in that game or not. Loan for Mitchell. Uh not really. Yeah, he can go. Can't stand him. Terrible player. Mitchell will stay. We want to stay at Mitchell at the club. I like Mitchell. Like him a lot. Yes, I did. All comments about any boxing, any main, just check out the channel. And of course, I've done extensive video talking about the fight um, in our members section. So. Oops, they cancel that, cancel that, cancel that. So, yeah.
don't want to don't kind of repeat what I've said but not surprising if you don't follow a game plan okay let's see now let's see what the office is saying reports final reports on players isn't it let's see oh well I need to do start looking for goalkeepers um they say that Argentina and Brazil are the best place the best place to buy players scouting wise for youth young players You stuff, let's have a look. Get available. Okay. <clears throat> you gotta go to Argentina. Yep. I really don't like my camera being in this corner because I can't see what's been said there. But wait, let me just change my camera rings. Because the camera's I hate the camera being there. I can't see anything. Can't see anything. I can see everything here now. Right, let's see. Six months. Let's go for. Go for a goalkeeper there. Brazil. There. Any. Two guys go there. And they said for wingers, the best place to go to wingers was to say China. Okay. Let's look and see how that all works out. Right. Let's get back to some of these games. Keep developing the young players as well. ARP. Nope, sorry. No way is ARP we're selling ARP. Forget it. Good, I'm glad a reef is sold. Um, squad. Um, we can roll. Art captain. Yep. And then let's a few players a chance now. Take Gomez out. Bring our rock in. Like it right away is. Um, give us ten to our game against Villa. Where he will play a game or two. And give Fergus in a game. And um, climb this out. Give push that game. Give some other players a chance, isn't it? That's what it's about. Give another players a chance and simulate them. Amada scored two goals. Jesus had scored a goal yet. Yeah, Arpsal for us and run up front. Okay. So he might have to get dropped next game. Okay. Next game is for the youth players, I think.
the squad together. Okay. Jansen plays up front. Richer to the left. Pretty young players a chance, isn't it? Where's where's my, where's my man Romis? Cruz. Yep, yeah, to the right. He's gonna play down left for us. Aaron's. Let's play defence for us now. Oh, Cardenas can play there. There you go. Cardenas, he actually is a winger. Uh, who have we got now? Central attack, Maybeville. Dreyfus. He's got a lot to prove. Not really play for the club much longer. Midfielders, we've got Sanchez. Where's our midfielders, man? Go and set the forward. Let's keep him on the bench for up. Remember that has going defence now because we don't know the game yet. Yeah, um, now the midfielders we've got. Gomez can come into midfield. So Rog, there you go. Need some more centre backs. I think they're both. Well, we've got no defenders. No. Should have out of form. Mitchell goes on the bench. Um, can I win a game? Can I can play? Striker attack him in just right. So I might just put Cano in there. Yeah, Cano's a better player than goes. We can just go there. Um, Aaron's into playing. Let's get to viewers out. He's going to get sold. The Vindictors can't play. Um, Hendrix, T is at four. Badger gets the play. You need a defender in as well. Let's have the defender. Dear, dear me, we need a defender. Alright, well, we've got a right back to play. No, he could play six foot four and he's sixty six. I guess he could play in defence. Yep. Got my choice, have we? Oh, yep. So we're gonna play with that a youth six a youth system. Could get messy this game. Very messy. Yes, come in. I'm live. Oh, sorry. sorry, you can come in. Okay. So I'm live. Okay. Well, I gather it's just somebody who wants to say hi to you from Africa. Oh. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> just you can get them on and say hello to them quickly. Yeah. Hello, sweetheart. This is Ingram Jones. Yeah. My 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 brother. Yeah. Hello, how are we doing? Hello? Did you hear me? Sorry, I've got headphones. Yeah, hello? How are you? Are you good? Good, I'm very well, thank you very much. Thank you. I'm very well. How was your day today? Where are you from in Africa? Uh, from, from Congo. Oh, lovely. Beautiful yeah. Congo. Beautiful Congo. My family my family are not from the Congo or the Africa, they're from the Caribbean. 
I'm currently from Trinidad and Grenada. Okay, that's that's Ingram Jones. It was a pleasure to meet you, ma'am. Okay. Yeah, he's busy. He's busy doing something. Yeah. Maybe some other time, right? Okay. <laughs> Our usual warm welcome to you all. Nice to have you with us. We're at Portsmouth, Batten Park, a famous old football ground on the south coast of England. There we go. Martin Tyler along with Alan Smith. It's Carabao Cup football for you. It's Portsmouth against Gillingham. Yeah, the winner takes all. No second leg in this tournament. So I'm expecting two sides to be on the front foot from the first whistle. Well, he really could be the star of the show today. He can manipulate the ball superbly. It seems as if it's on a string at times. I'm Portsmouth till I die. I know I am, I'm sure I am. I'm Portsmouth till I die. Well, I'm glad to hear you're getting better, my friend. Line up for the home side. Thank you. Enjoy the game. Portsmouth have kicked off today. The game is underway. Ferguson. Intercepted. Room now out of the wing. Good position for the cross. Towards the near post. Punched away by the keeper. That's a corner. corner played in are we going to get an upset here well they've given themselves a chance by taking the lead well this could go down as one of the biggest shocks can't believe it what a great goal that was Alan it was a nice corner and didn't he attack it well and that has opened the scoring 1-0 here read the play well won it back easily now can he take them on well, they've got him behind here flag's gone up Alan yeah and I think it's a good call from the assistant Ferguson go on Excellent son movement to get the pass and stay on side this could bring them level and it does Important point in the game. Well, what a game changer that might be. And I think the momentum's just shifted. Well, it's the understanding you've got to admire here, Martin. The ladder getting on to the end of it. The boys seeing the pass quickly. Well, it's a goal worth replaying over and over again, isn't it? Well done, son. Well done. Well done. It is uh, level. Both sides have scored here now. The youngster does it again for us, Janssen. Encouraging play from this team now. Keeping the ball. A chance to play it into the centre now.
Well, Gantner's going to go, you know. Taking on a couple of opponents now. It's good play to uh, get a foot in and intercept. Nothing wrong with the industry of the team. This is how they love to play on the break. And it's one of those that hits the post and goes in to the delight of the scorer. He might have missed it, I don't know, but he doesn't care. Just touched in off the post. Goalkeeper absolutely beaten. Oh, it's a wonderful strike. Who looks this better? And we've got some defensive issues here tonight. Yeah, you know, defender. The guy we've got in defence is not doing it for us. Uh, Schneider, he's not helping us at all. He's making it very difficult for us today. Dance back, who can play it right back? Can, can make them come right into centre back? No, you can't. I can't even ask him for centre back here. Nope. Can Richard play centre If Richard could play centre back, we'd be away. Nope. We have some problems defensively. Oh well. For Portsmouth having conceded that goal. Ah! It's a very good interception. Oh. And now the shot. That's saved in very straightforward fashion by the goalkeeper. Blocked off the pass there. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. When you get round to the round, the cup the because he's better than and the referee spotted that deflection. He's pointed for the corner. Well, this guy looks like he's the one the opposition having the most problems with. Well, the goalkeeper will be hoping his defenders can. And he's seen the shot. Oh, Super thank you very much. To reach that great technique and great belief to feel that he could stop the goal. We all are looking at goals, Martin, but there's something special about a defender showing those kind of defensive instincts. Chance for the cross. Not frightened at going for goal from a tight angle there. Yeah, it was tight, but he caught it well. Not a bad effort. They've got the ball back by that interception. The fourth official has indicated Excellent interception. there will be a minimum of three minutes of added time. Still got a bit to do, but this is promising. Got to be. Kept his concentration, the goalkeeper, and because of that, kept hold of the ball. Well, Not a great half. Blown for half time Not here, a good half. With 2-1 the score. We have turned some things around here. And, uh, yep. Got to turn some things around here. We've got some players to turn it around with. Put the miles on. Definitely who's Sousa up front. Bring Aaron's into the game. Leave things as they are. Jesus on now, so at least start changing things around. Good action in the English League now Cup got in the first 45 goals. minutes. Second half starts now. Yeah, I think one or two players surprised us actually how well they played in that first half. They'll be delighted. Janssen's good. Good for Janssen. In his career. Now we need to get him to go. Gabriel Jesus. Gabriel Jesus. 
Keeper refusing to be overpowered here. What a shot. Well, the corner could equal a chance to level it up. And that ball oh. belongs to the goalkeeper. Need to get back into this game as quick as possible. Three young, three of the top guns on now. Challenges for the ball. I think that's a good performance, isn't it, Alan, from him in the first half? Well, he played really well, didn't he? And he got himself a goal to put his team ahead. He'll be pleased with that first Part score to goal here, boys. And the keeper can collect this one. Come on, he's going that. We'll see this team on, again off. soon. Come this on, is get their next fixture, which we'll bring to you on EA Sports. Gabriel Jesus! And they pulled it back level. And that's what we needed. Things right now. We'll talk about against the run of play, but they do not care one bit. That's what we needed. Brilliant entertainment. The scores are level again. Very tight affair here. Very exciting news, isn't it, for the buying club that the deal has been completed? Well, it's easy to waste money in this day and age, but I don't think that's going to be the case here. Gabriel Jesus. Oh, he's through. Oh! Hit the post! Let in the shot go! Oh! Elasticity from the goalkeeper. Wonderful agility, that. Really superb. Corner played in. It's not really away. Poor clearance. That's a vital slipping it through. Really in the clear now. Real chance now. Keeper did well to reach it, but he couldn't keep it. Led the play well to intercept. Has a go here. What a game we've had here. It's in deep good vision here. Oh, what a noise they're making. Not long left. Oh, come on. There's going to be a substitution. It's for the away team. Still got a bit to do, but this is promising. Well, very easy for the goalkeeper there. Come on, this is there, man. Tucker wasteful pass unforced error really ten minutes left of regular time that's the shoot absolutely no trouble for the goalkeeper here always we need to get that goal man we just need to get that goal Quickly. And he gets it back. I don't he's going to draw because it was just there for us. Well, here it is. He's missed the target by quite a lot in the end. He has got the opportunity to change the tactics as well as the players with some movement from the bench. Need a goal now. Just need a goal. We're on the field again. Blocked off the pass there. Well, he looks as though the. Uh, Game has taken a bit out of him. Four more minutes. Substitute coming up for the away team. Excellent vision. Well, the play is broken down now. Solidly away. Here's a chance. That's a goal. And I think that's the end of this marvellous adventure. Well, it's been a valiant effort, hasn't it? But... In the end, I think they just ran out of legs. It's a great moment for the goal scorer and for his team. It surely won the game in the dying moments. It must have, and it was a really good take as well. Didn't have much time in he the box it. there. Cano. Yes, Cano! Well done, Cano. Another youth play wins it for us. 
What a goal from Victor Cano. Played well. Well done, Victor Cano. Well, a very exciting climax to an exciting game. This could be the decider. Well, it could be at this stage of the match. There doesn't seem much of an opportunity to come back. And the referee has blown his whistle for the last time. 3-2. A confirmation, then, of their success in this cup tie today. Well, they sailed close to the wind once or twice. Some good saves from the keeper, but I think they just about deserve this win. That's a relief. Good. Canna came on and scored a goal for us. It's brilliant news for us. A youth player to come on and score a goal. Just a moment okay. of time. Yeah, I think we can. Got to play better than that, though. No. Be all thank you. You're welcome. You thought you played well in the end, certainly not. Uh, don't want to be doing that too more two games too often, but that's good. Glad to see Cannot get the goal for us. Good. Um, so let's see what train needs to be done next. Good for the youngster though, it's really good to see a youngster get a goal for us in the end. Do you want to leave for another club at the end of this year? Definitely. Definitely want to leave the club this year. Start a new challenge, maybe go to MLS or something. Yeah, they go to MLS. Different challenge. Something just somewhere else to go, just not the same old England, Scotland. Nice to go to Rangers, maybe develop a squad at Rangers. Be nice to leave England though. Do a club outside of England. New challenge altogether. Right, let's go to the squad now. Change the squad up. We've now got Liverpool coming up, so. Asus is out. Bring Gutoir back into the side. You know, Bochilla's fit, Rog's fit, Tamori back. Um, Make the Mars back. Um, who else? Sintas is out. Davido back in defence, that's good. Nice solid defence there. Yeah, you know who has got front, Barp up front. Goes man, he's, not, he's out injured, damn, my mind is out injured. That's not good. It gives Bushillo a chance to play. Cynthia. Mm, here 
Rock. He's not injured. He hasn't improved for how many years? He hasn't improved. Stay, stay the same. And um, who's he got? Yeah. We goes out as well. So. Okay. Since the other play. Just gonna play down the right then. Well, we might have no choice. What do you want now? Jesus Christ. Yes. Hey, okay? I'm live, what do you want? What? Ah, shut up, man. I'm gonna go, with it, man. See you later. Bye bye. <laughs> Gomez, uh, Cruz, let's see now. It's a good play. We've got no Rodriguez play down right inside for us. Mm, we haven't got another winger. I can't believe this. Mm. Got to play someone down the right hand side. Oh, we've got a problem now. We haven't got a right winger. I said he could play down right in theory. So you could play down right. Then who's going to play down the left for us? I don't know. Aaron's could play down the left hand side for us. There. That solves that little problem there. But, man, we need to improve on some players. That's not bad, fellow. Jansen, 69, and he's only, uh, what, 16. Come on, guys. You tell me he's not really a superstar player there. Right, I don't know whether we'll beat Liverpool, this squad, but at some point we've got to start stepping up and beating the big teams. It's better be that season. I'd like to go to, I think I'm going to go to MLS next. I'm going to go to MLS next, that'd be good. Right, people in the room now chatting, so let me just bring you all in because you're chatting now, so... Um, so I can see, no, no, cancel that. Let me see where your comments are. Let's get you in the room now. Right, he's definitely got, gonna be keep training, yeah. Definitely a superstar player there. So, I don't care if we win or we lose against Liverpool at this point. There we go. So we're improving as a team. That's that's good to see. So I'm simming the season until we play the top teams. All right. Can't imagine no place been sold. Sanchez. Kajerma Sanchez, let's have a look at Kajerma Sanchez again. He's 22 in 66. I think he has to go. <laughs> 22 in 66? Nah, he should go. Honestly. Need some better players in the club now, for sure. Moses Keane's gone to damn flipping Paris. Who's next? Cano, going on loan. Mm, Cano just scored a goal for us. Would you sell? Would you put him on loan? I mean, I guess he could. How was he? Seventeen? One point five million? It won't harm him. It won't harm him.
Cano was loaned out. Well, you'd think he'd go, could have gone out loan. Cruz, that's our right winger. Um, it's 19 at 68. Yeah, you go for a season. Go on. You're going to have to bring some new players into the club, that's all. Rog. 13 million. Now, if I sold Rog, I mean, I'm thinking of doing it because he's not improving. But it's Salati. But if we got in midfield to play instead of Rog, we haven't. We do need to invest in another midfielder. I'm not joking, we do. Um, we get a world class, an extra low class midfielder. If I get a world class midfielder in, I'll take it. Uh, nope. Give me a, on a world class. No, give me a work. No, I'm gonna add a. I'm gonna add a world class midfielder to our side because I just think we need one. Central midfield, world class. Nope. Midfield, got to be a midfielder, and he's got to be fairly decent. Bell Transon midfield. Nope. Thirty million. Nope. Mm, okay, Chelsea, no. Wolves Prowse. I mean, it's about time we had an Englishman playing in midfield for us. He's 30 now. I mean, Chowdhury. Wow. 20 million. Wow, oh, Chowdhury. He can't pass the ball, that man. He's got crushing his interceptions and stamina. He can't freaking pass the ball. That's not going to work, is it, for us? But I like the hairstyle. 53 million. We're going to spend that much money on a player. He's a good player. Less sided. Oh, so he's Finch as well. 5 11. 83. Pass is not great. Benneka, I like. No. Tonight is a good player, though. Dyer, Englishman, no. Nah. 52 million for a pass and defend is quite decent there, man. How was he? 22. Perez, nope. Hmm, it's got good passing. 28 million. Good passing, good. It's got athleticism. It's got acceleration, sprint speed, reaction's quite good. Vision's good. He's not your normal player that I'd bring in. Look at his speed. He's got good speed, decent speed in him. And he's worth how much? 28 million. Okay, he's one I'd get. Oh, now here's a man that I like. Kessie. Yes, Cameron. I like Kessie. Oliver Torres, back in the day. Well, he used to play for Arsenal. Dominguez. Mm -mm. Wilson just rabble now I love this guy I can't justify him being inside know him nope nope can't justify you guys Coutinho De Jong good player too much money 37 million no can't just pass the, passing and defending is good nope can't defend oh a bit tasty here Nope, not paying for you though. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, Ica, Ica, Ica. Love Ica, man. Longstaff, the Englishman. Can't def I can't justify having you. Nope, Torreira. Nope, definitely not. Grealish. Nope. Nope. Sanchez, 28 million. 45 million release. Defending attack is not great. Sprint speed's great. But 28, good player. I like people call this guy Golovkin. His name's Golovin. But no, 150 million, no, it's not happening. No, not paying that kind of money for a midfielder. 
No, Aaron Ramsey, 34 years old. No, I'm not going to get it. At least a good player. I'm not going to buy you, though. Gomez, no. Rodri, no. Saar, no. Loftus Cheek. Now, there's a boy I would buy. Loftus Cheek, I would buy. 29 years old. Yeah, I'd buy Loftus Cheek. Bring him back to England, why not? I've only got 22 million. So then all that big talk. <laughs> all that massive talk I was talking. All that good stuff I was talking. I've only got 22 million in the bank. And nothing for wages. So uh, that's not really going to work out now, is it, lads? <laughs> not going to work out at all. Uh, so I'm going to have to uh, reduce my... Uh, See what they've got. Let's see what we've got on the release. Maybe we might release somebody for Yeah, release a midfielder for a silly amount of fright money. You know what I mean? Um uh, central mid. And the reason I'm doing this now is because just in the Oh come on. Do this to me man. Thank you. The maximum age cannot be 50. 30. 1 is the maximum of setting. Right, now give me what you've got. 4.5. Nope. You release 10. 15 million I will take. 10, 15 million for release. If you're not right, 15 million, 28. Dostadorf, 5 foot 9. Alright, I'm looking at you. You're 15 million. I'm looking at you. Blanco, nope, sorry, 30, no chance. Now, I like your hairstyle, boy. Nope, sorry. 15 million I'm prepared to spend. Even 20 million. 11 million, nope. Not touching you, son. Nope. 15, 20 million. I will spend no more. 13 million. Falcal. 13, 31. Nope, sorry, sir. Thirty-one though. No. Ooh. Fifteen minutes. What's that there? No. No, come on. Somebody's got this. 18 million. Joffrey. Spanish. Ball control. Balance. Dribbling. Yo, listen, I'm just trying to find a player just to. I've already got the players I want on my side. I'm just last minute getting somebody in because. Just to remember, my squad is basically around my youth now. I'm building a youth squad. Remember this. I'm not just building a building youth squad. I'm not doing this game much longer. I'm going to go across soon. I'll be doing my uh, ultimate team. Right. We're going to go back to the guy I was originally going to go for. He was worth, what, 15? It's 1.11 million. Connell, no. I'm not going for you, mate. So this guy's 15 million. There was a 15 million. Map. There we go. He was 30. Bronco, 5 foot 6. Agility, balance, acceleration, stamina, dribbling. Teddy Bishop, I remember trying to get him before. He let me down. Big time. Come on, where are you? 15 million. He had a funny name as well. There you go. Oh. There you are, 15 million. Short pass, balance, re stamina, reaction, strength, yep, yeah, just, just... No. I'd love to have given Englishman a chance. Going back on exactly what I said. Alright. 0.75 million. I'd just like to have a funny looking guy in this. Dribbling, finishing, long shots, reactions, short pass. 
Oh, you're just a midfield, I'll get you. Even if you're garbage, I'll just get you, man. 2.9, I'll get you. 26 years old. Just somebody fill the midfield position, to be honest. It doesn't really matter. It's first in quality. No, nope, can't get him. Being distracted again from what I was going to get. How you been, Cameron? What's been going on? His first team quality, he's from Barcelona. We ain't got nothing to lose. He's from Barcelona. If he's in his late 70s, I don't care. Backup midfielder. Rotation. There you go. Occasional cat to come to the squad. Two years. Yeah, all right. We're not going to spend much money on Evil. Yep. So you want me to release? Cool. Top money. So how much is he worth at the moment? Let's give him. I don't know worth. He's worth. I'll give him eighty thousand. Uh, with a signing bonus of. I don't know. Yeah, I'll give him ninety thousand. Hell with it. I mean. Man, oh, man, a signing bonus, man. Give me up 19th. Yeah, hell, I don't even know what you're worth, but you're probably getting paid over the top. But who cares? In you're in the squad now. I wonder what the fans will think about that. I'd probably get slaughtered for it. Let's see what they say. Portsmouth News. Mm. See what the fans think about that news. Van Dusen. Who's got Van Dusen? He's a good defender, Van Dusen. That's what they say about him. Fruitful spark, former club Barcelona. Okay. Okay, so he's... I don't know what to say. But apart from he's done well. Hold on. Yes, Tim. Thank you the other day. Appreciate that. What you your comment the other day. Who have we drawn? Leverkusen, and Valencia and PSK Moscow. Okay. Don't know if I want to play all those Champions League games to be honest. I might try and just skip half the Champions League games. I just want to get to the quarter final, two finals and final to be done with it tonight. That guy's Collada 70 or more, 75 or more, I'm happy. Another play to develop now. Who else are we developing? Gomez. Asensio is in he's going down, that's not good. You feel the Gomez Ortiz. Collado is what? It's 80? 79. Dang! It's almost 80. Okay, let's work in. Let's keep developing our superstar striker in Jensen. Yeah. Okay, England. I don't really care what England's doing. Let me go to the season. And calendar, let's see if we can get to our next game. If we got what's that? Leeds Valencia. Let's go we gotta get to. Yes. Get me to Valencia game. I've got to win the title with uh Portsmouth. Right. I've gotta beat Leeds. Um, okay. Valencia, let's see back where we are now. I don't even want to play the whole. I want to get through to the quarterfinals. Thanks for the comment the other day, Tim. We really appreciate it. Okay. Um, 
let's see the squad now. You can do see Bushilla. Well, a lot of players are going to come back into the side now. Who have not been playing. Jesus isn't a chance to play. Let's bring the big boys back in. Armada in. No messing around. Champions League, we're not messing around. Vincent is in. Rig ain't played much recently. Sensi, I don't know what's going with him, but keep him on the bench, keep him nearby. Gomez, take a break. Collado. Um. Rog. They get him in. Gummies on the bench. Yeah. Get Bushilla somewhere. Lucentio's gonna inform then. Bushilla, come on, that's it. Yeah. I'm trying to skip these games, get through to the quarterfinals, semi final, finals, that's what I'm interested in. Let's see if we can let's see if we start this off well. Tell the press conference. It's away from home. Sea todo el mundo bienvenido. Las preguntas comenzarán en breve. Bargains of the year. He'll prove he's the right guy. Yep, we'll see if it's the day. We need to put, need to put Collado on the bench actually, so he can get his confidence there. Because he's not happy, so let me just make sure Kalara is on that bench. If we decide not to start with him, fine, but we do, we'll have him on the bench, so he's on the bench, good. Good, 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 good. Let's sim this game, boys. If it's bad, then I'll obviously jump in. Come on, boys, we should beat Valencia, good enough. 2-0. Clada coming on. is playing as well. Pugue. Armada missed a penalty. Armada keeps missing his penalties. That's not great. Table. Got him, Rock. Yeah, at the moment. Uh, I'll just read your comments in the comments section. Popcorn with BWT and while Mrs. Sleeps. Thank you very much. So, the aim here today is to. And the beer. The aim today is, I'm going to come off of it, I'm going to go play some uh, thing football in a minute. But uh, the aim of this is to keep playing and get our young players a chance to play at the same time. Creating your world class players. Oh dear, we've got Chelsea now. We have to beat Chelsea as well. Okay guys, we're ready to start taking some questions now. We've got to beat Chelsea now. We say the, the win's going to continue. We have to beat Chelsea. It's consistency this season. Beat Chelsea. Go keep showing that we're the team this season. They lost 4-1 to Man City. We need to be beating Chelsea. And we have done 1-0. Good stuff. Arp is not scoring enough goals for me at the moment. Portsmouth for Millwell. This is the game. We've just got to keep building our youth players up. Look for some new ones. Let's see now. Let's go to our youth our office. Youth office. Uh, no wage budget at the moment. We can sort that out. Let's go to our um, 
to go to our budget at the moment. Take five million of that budget and invest it. Yeah. There we go. That'll do into the youth stuff. Okay. First of all, let's look at the youth players we do have in the academy. Look at that. 16. It's 88 to 94. Charlie Bell, centre back. Definitely would love to promote him and get him playing. 82 to 92. Pedro Jesus. Look at that. Midfielder. No, no, no. We, why did we release him? Oh, right. We need to get some players. We need to sell some players at our squad now. Our players are... Right. Um, squad hub. We need to go to squad hub now and start cleaning out some of these youngsters. Prospect. Right. Who have we got in this side now that we think we need to move on? 18. 69. Prospect. Mm. 16, 61. Yeah. Right. Bell, 16. Potentially special. We're going to have to keep Bell. He's alright. Ortiz. Yeah, he needs to... He needs to go, Ortiz. Yeah. He needs to go. Gallo. 1866. Mm, don't know. Sanchez. We were trying to sell him, right? Let me see. Oh, yeah, we'll sell him. Get rid of him. That's two players out. Ready? Making space. Peters, I think, is going to move on, but there's not much at the moment. 1761 1861 Boschilla mm. may have to kick on soon Gomez mm. removed from the transfer list definitely Marda one of the world's best got great potential Deverius he needs to be going online if he's got great potential Sencio, 29. Smith Rowe on loan, 80. 1973. 90 to one of the world's best. Cruz, 1968. One of the world's best. And Rodrigo. Vega, 87. De La Vega. Wow, look at that. He's going to be coming back soon. Looking forward to having him back at the club. The new Messi, they're calling him. Contessa, 18 at 57. He needs to go, I think. Cano, we saw him score the other day. Gomez, great potential, the same. Jansen, I can't believe that he's got great potential. But at 16, this guy's got not great potential. This guy's going to be a world-class player. I don't, I don't get it. He's all, he got his own way to a superstar. We know Gabriel Jesus. One of the world's best. All right, so... We definitely need to be bringing in, for me, those youth players. Um, let's go back to those youth players again. No, not the ones that are, the one in our academy. Right, a couple of guys we definitely need to sign in now. Jesus, absolutely. He's what, 16, 54, and his potential is 82 to 92. I think we'll be signing him. Nope. 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 Okay, you guys can wait where you are. Now let's see what we've got in our. Let's see what our youth staff picked up. I like going to. Let's see what we've got. A goalkeeper. When you look for three good quality goalkeepers, let's see. 53, 73, nope. 63 to 85, maybe. 54, 74. 73 to 94. We'll take that one. I don't want to want five foot. I don't want my midgets as a goalkeeper. There's no disrespect to midgets, but it just doesn't work for me as a goalkeeper. Okay. Okay. Now, A plays Brazilian. Let's see. Okay. 
70 to 94 I'll take that big gap but it's still 70 in it so we'll take the 70 to 94 and then we I think we went to sign a winger we went to China to look for a winger 60 to 82 mm, 70 to 94 Good sp okay. 69 to 93. Gap's big, but we'll sign you anyway. There we go. We've got some young players inside. Now, we need to go to Africa. Forget the wingers. We need to go to Africa, right, and get a whole bunch of defensive players. Um, relocate scout. Okay, send a bunch of players over to Africa, I think goes over to Africa now and look to, okay now where are we now, Millwall game, okay, let's see, player saying, a loan, yes, yeah you need to go on loan mate, Let's have a look at the squad I've got now. Youth players again. Okay. Dennis on the right. Jansen up front, the youngster, 16 again. I think this guy's better than actually Rooney. If I'm right. When did Rooney burst onto the scene? Anybody remember when Rooney burst onto the scene? He's going to play down right first. Where's Cruz? I think Cruz went on loan. Uh, if Cruz has gone on loan, then Henrik's will take his role instead. Rog and Gadusi. Forget Rog. Let's give who we've got in midfield to play. Nobody. Need some more midfielders. Let's give Collado his debut. And Gomez can play attack mid. No defence. Bremer can play. Bell can go on the bench. Rog can take a break. Amada can come off. Let's do it. On you come. Richard left back. No, no, no. Good. Rodrigo. Hmm. Focus to the right. Bell should play, I think. So even if he hasn't, uh, five foot nine, it's against me on uh, defenders. So five foot nine defenders is against me, but All right, there you go. Schneider could play in defence as well for us. He was terrible last time. Right. Right back. Why do I need Nate Miles as well? I don't. Who else have we got? We can play youngster. Gomez. Yep. Here we go. The rowdy Millwall crowd. Hold on, boys. Oh. Oh. 
There we go. Cup football again. <clears throat> and hello from the city of Portsmouth. Welcome to Fratton Park. My name is Derek Ray. With me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and England defender Lee Dixon. And live action coming up from the Carabao Cup. It's Portsmouth and they take on Millwall. Well, thank you, Derek. With being big favourites, complacency can be a problem. You've got to use that to your advantage if you're playing a home side as expected to go through. Can they put the pressure on in the first 20 minutes and hold out and then try and nick the game in the second half? Well, let's dissect the Portsmouth starting 11. Till I die, I know I am, I'm sure I am, I'm Portsmouth till I die, Turf till I die, till I die, Portsmouth till I die. Okay, can you, can Jensen do it again for us, the 16 year old? Could be more responsible at the back today, for sure. Oh, the right man. Come on, guys. Oh. No real threat from the shot mm -mm. saved by Gurtuan. Come on, guys. We've got to be better than this today. All right, good. When Doozy, he's got space. Go on, Hendrix. Good pull. Matteo Guendouzi. Well, just couldn't keep the ball. Go on, Hendricks. Go on, Bugs. Go on. Working brilliantly as a team to force the clearance. It's good it work, yeah. It's a nice little turn there for the youngster. For a 16 year old. To win the ball back. I imagine 16 year old bossing big players. Can't believe that. Bossing big men at 16. Wow. Well, Lee, interested to get your opinion in the potential approach of the visitors oh. today. Will it lead to the goal that puts them ahead? Is a moment he would dearly love to have back if possible. Yeah, it wasn't his best effort, was it? But I bet he thought, I haven't got anything on, why not try a shot? Yeah, exactly. Don't be scared, Jensen. Keep going, mate. Don't get disheartened. Gomez. Oh, Jensen! Still passing it around with authority. Oh. And a very good challenge. Oh, I think we'll have to smash this ball from outside the box. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Good looking ball. Oh. There could be a chance now. Is it going to be? Can they make the connection here? Oh. Textbook defending inside the box. We're like Nigel Ben. We're dangerous. Gomez. We're wounded. Showing teamwork and commitment. But a Nigel Ben of football. Just when you think you've got us hurt, we rally back and do something. Oh! Well, oh, unlucky. Keep himself onside. The flag has gone up. Don't worry, relax yourself, Jensen, man. You'll get your chance again. Gomez. Oh. That's how to flummox. Will he finish? Jensen! And a powerful effort, but just lacking accuracy. Yeah, narrowly wide, Derek. Decent effort. He smashed it. Come on, man, Jensen. Got scored every round. Slipshod passing. I think he's already broken a Rooney record. He scored at 16. Did Rooney score Might a new 16? I don't know. From this position. What can he do from here? Crossing possibilities. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Get there. Not too fussy now on the counter. Lines. Go on, son. Is it Jensen? Hold it up. Nice. Oh. oh a nice looking pass. Nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. And the flag has gone up here. Offside the decision. Oh. Andy Lee. What's Andy Lee doing? Gomez, Matteo Guendouzi, the attack continues, they're making considerable progress, and the oh. teams are locked together, will it stay that way, following this corner, 
crowd haven't had too much to cheer up. Gets his glove on it. Wonderful time. Guys, we were expecting Millwall too much here. We're playing them like the Barcelona. Plenty of running room in the wide position. Others to play it to. But he has clear options in the middle. Right. Insufficient. Get a move on. on the crossing front, you've got right. to say. What are we doing? What are you doing? Well done. Oh no! Shot attempted. And a goal it is. The opener in this game. Well, keep it tight. That's what both managers would have been saying. I was just saying it. I was just saying it. Well, my initial opinion was to blame the goalkeeper, but here we get a better angle of it. Absolutely nothing it can do. A huge deflection. Keeper, no chance. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. We don't need that. We really don't need that. Well, what are we doing? Well, the showing signs of frustration. They need to improve if they're going to get something out of this game, Derek. Every time we put these dodgy so goal defenders, things happen. Right, we need to get back in this game now. No more gameplay, man. Serious. What are you doing? Go Get into the box. Thank you. He takes aim. Right, I'm going to leave that. Tremendous block. Rank amateurs today. It hasn't come to Rank amateurs. What is that as a pass? Jeez. It might be on for them. What are you doing, Gomez? My God! You can beat Liverpool. You can't do the business against Mateo the team. Guendouzi. The first half here comes to an end. Well, I can't expect Yanta to score a six-year score every game. Let's see what's going on here. Ferguson, you disgrace. All right, Schneider comes in. Clear we need a bit more boost in midfield, so don't miss. Drop into midfield for me. Bushilla, boy, I need you to come on today and make some magic. And hey, I want us to get through to the next round. Jansen, no respect, no disrespect on you. Oh, can you come over? Rodrigo. Yeah, I think you need to come on as well. Oh shoot. Well. Bush between Bushilla. You three have got to do the business now, mate. I'm telling you now. We cannot be getting knocked out but by Millwall. Teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. So we need to get it right straight away. No messing around. Coming with Gabriel and Jesus. And Keeping the ball moving. Move it. Let's go. Go this. Gomez. Possession for Portsmouth, no problem. But after that, it's been disappointing. I'd like to see them use those wide areas around the defence. Get round them, I suppose, to trying to go through the middle. Gabriel Jesus now. It's a perfect challenge. Come on, boys. We've got to do better than this. We just... Yeah, I'm like this no water player football. Come on. And that's an important Let's intervention. Go, Caduceus. Right. Well... Well, this is the home of live football, EA TV, and we have more action coming up from the Premier League I can't for you. Can't it's Portsmouth facing Manchester City. Yeah, that looks a great matchup, doesn't it? Looking forward to oh some boys, fast Come on, boys! What are we doing? There. What are we doing? Now, can he deliver accurately? Right, he's cutting off. Go! Block. What are you doing? Spot on with that tackle. What can he do from here? We really don't want to win the Carabao Cup, do? You really Fails don't want to win the Carabao Cup, properly. do you? Now. You really don't want to win the Carabao Cup, do you? You guys are playing like idiots. Looks promising this. Business. And the cross is very much on. And delivered towards the back post. <sighs> what a corner kick it is. Let's see if they can put this to good use as they try to add to their advantage. And a substitution in the offing. Why are we making it so difficult for area. ourselves? Get the ball away from the box. Oh, he's found the net. And that increases the advantage to two. Just what they wanted and just what they deserve. Well, I want to see this one again. And there it is. I wonder how he gets so much power from that position. But he really does. It's a brilliant, brilliant effort. So, 2-0 now. Goal for the visitors. Number five, John Kimpel.
poor pass under no real pressure. Failed to keep hold of it. Dangerous looking attack. Wait, hold on a second. Where's Jesus? Okay. Check in. What are we doing? What are we doing? Well, it's come down to the final 20 minutes here. We've got to do some magic in 20 minutes. We've the, the time goalkeeper, to go man. To the move it. Jokes aside there, man. We've got to get a move. Come well, on. Read there to intercept. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Teammate. And this time, it's in. That rod. That rod. Well, it's good build up, but there's one player standing in front of the goal, and it falls to him, and he's not going to miss from there. That rod. Well, let's take another well, look Schiller. at that goal, shall we? All right, that's what we're talking about. Let's get back in this game now. Well, as they kick off again, 2 1, the current state of affairs. And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. Read it magnificently and intercepted. I don't care if you're knackered now. You have to play. What the hell are you doing? Well, he's lost the ball. I don't care how knackered you are. You're going to push. Into the advanced position. Go. He's lost it. Just listen to the crowd, Derek. Urging their team on. Surely they'll get another chance. A bit sloppy in possession. Highly purposeful attack this. Oh. The emphasis on getting the ball forward. It's with Jed Wallace. Bradshaw. Oh, this guy is so sloppy. Cooper. Win the ball, come on. Win it. Win it. Oh my god. Bradshaw. Win the damn ball. Just cutting off Go. the supply. Well, the atmosphere is electric. The crowd are really trying to urge the players on. Use that energy as a player. Come on. What are you doing? Giving them the gift of possession. Just wanted to get it out of there. Time is not on the side. This corner could help their prospects as they look for an equaliser. Wonderful block. Two minutes. Oh. Oh, I've lost this game now. Get the ball, but kick the ball out. Well done. There it is, the final whistle, and that puts the official stamp on it. They are through to the next round. Well, sometimes, Derek, it's not just about what quality you have in a team. It's about heart, desire, hunger. We saw that today in this team. And youth team ain't good enough yet. The youth team are not good enough. They put in a really thorough Not good enough. It's frankly, not good enough. That's what it is. We're trying to build these youth players, but not good enough. Can't say anything more than that. Yeah, it's a youth team. You know, so. Time for a few quick questions. That's not good. Uh, lots to learn. We can and do, should do better. Yeah. Just got to concentrate on how we play better. Thank you, that's it for the question. You know, you want to give your young players experience, but, I mean, <laughs> what do you say? What can you say? Right, let's get it right now. Let's get our top players back in the side. ASAP. <laughs> uh, just to repeat, uh, just to remind everybody that's watching, that was my youth side playing and not my full squad. As you'll see now, the difference when I start to put my youth, my full players together, that um, it's a different looking squad. So don't panic. I'm trying to give my youth players as much opportunity as possible to play. Um, unfortunately. <coughs> They are not up to the quality they need to be just yet. But look, I'm talking about youth players. This guy's 16 years old, and as you see, he's 
70 already rated so okay 21 to 72 he might be on his way out so I so I wouldn't panic too much as you can see I'm trying to build superstars of the future And usually we don't concede stupid goals like that. Defence wasn't helpful at all. But you'll see now as I start to put the team together. That um, it does look a lot more different when I actually put the team together. The way it should be put together. As you can see now, the loads I've got is 79 inside, but it's not even in one side. See, let's just get rolls. Now our team are back. Now we're back to playing serious football again. Well, the Carabao Cup was serious, but oh, Joey, thank you so much for joining and becoming a member. I really appreciate that. Thank you for the love and thank you for becoming a member. Appreciate it. Right, so we'll sim this game now. Come on, guys, we've got to beat Man City. True. Armada keeps missing penalties. I've got to wonder if he should be doing penalties anymore. Right, I need to go and who we play next. So the aim is not to play the Champions League games if possible. We can slip through the Champions League games. Play only if necessary. Um, the main thing is to get to the quarterfinals. So second round, third round. Armada, we've got to change his tactics. Armada's not doing good for me in penalties. So whoever the, pen whoever the penalty taker should be it should not be Armada. Should Caduce be doing free kicks? I don't know. Uh, I don't know yet. We'll see. Let's see. Should I? Um, yep. Go online, mate. Off online, you should go. Um, I'm thinking at the end of this season, I would like to go to either America. I would like to go to America, actually, honestly, from this and play in the American League. Be nice. Thanks, guys. We're going to get started with the questions now. That's all we have. Okay, I'll bring your comments. Now there's people in the room again, I will... Let me just change it so I can see your comments again. So I can read your comments now. Right, it says there. Uh, but is the America version of Champions League in this game? I think it might be. Either... I just want to go somewhere I don't normally go. Uh, or you guys choose where I go next. If not America. We'll go somewhere else. It'd just be nice... In terms of tagging for the, the the channel and everything, oh, Armada can still play. It's Caduce that can't play, so we'll take Caduce out, and Calado will play. No worries there. Calado plays. Caduce is out, and Gomez is in. All right. Well, take Calado out and bring Gomez in. Italy, that's yep, that's a, that's a good point. That's a good point. Italy's good. I haven't been to Italy in years. Um, 
Uh, what club would I work for? Italy, Italian side. Uh, whatever I do, whatever club I want to go to next. Because if you go on FIFA today, yeah. If you got, no, if you go on YouTube today, well done, boys. If you go on YouTube today, you will find Brazil something different for not. Yeah. If you go on Braz if you go on YouTube at the moment, you will see that there's so many people that are doing ports the Portsmouth safe. So it'd be nice to go to another club or go to another country, go to another place. So if I can do that, if I can do that, that'd be great. A new challenge. Don't forget, um, Kenny, by the way, I am doing the Ultimate Team, just not on this channel. I'm, I'm doing it on the old DWTM Gaming channel. If you can get across and check that out as well. Uh, subscribe to BWTM Gaming. It's the Twitch channel. So make sure you're on our Twitch side. I will do this game for another... No, we do this for another, I don't know, half an hour. What do you think, Joey? Another hour? And then we'll go and do some Ultimate Team tonight? Because I'm really getting to my Ultimate Team now. So let me know what you think about that. Oh, we've got to beat Man United. We've just got to beat Manchester United. Just remind me, by the way. Just remind me, guys, so I don't get carried away with this. Please beat Man United. Please beat Man United. If you're Man United sport, no, no, per no personally. Don't take it personally. Yes. It's important this year we win the It's for this important this year that we win the league. Spurs a second. Oh, my God. I can't have Spurs beating us either. I know you say Twitch is... Twitch, actually, that's not actually true. Because from what I've been told, the graphics are better on Twitch than they are on YouTube. See, now Cameron agrees with it. So it's interesting. But if you want me to do YouTube, then fine. I'm not going to... If you guys want that, then... Another player's going on loan. All these players are going on loan. 7.5 million for him. Look at him. Ah, gotcha. I don't care about England. I really don't. No disrespect, but I don't. Um, season. Let's get to the next game, which is... I don't care about Ireland. We've got Arsenal. I don't care about the Arsenal game. Get me to Leverkusen. I see the platform is already here on YouTube. It makes sense, but I think Ultimate Team has a big following on... Twitch. Yeah, there you go, see? Yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm doing the ultimate team on Twitch. I'm doing career mode on this. Okay, let's see where we are in the leagues. I hope we're still in the league. Okay, who have we got now? Disappointed not to play in the last game. Okay, we'll get you in the squad. Don't worry, we'll get your game, son. Okay, let's get you in the next game. All these players are going, want to go on loan now. I can't believe this. I'm really happy all our young players are getting a chance to go on loan though. I really am. Um, so Brendan wants to play in the squad. Okay. We'll sort that for you, son. Um, squad. Let's make the changes. Um, Tomori out. Home. Let's get Bremen in game. Let's give, yeah, Bremen in. Tomori out. Just to. There we go. Um, let's give a sense of game as well. Switch some things around. Give a his game. Play up front. Ferguson. Play up right back. Bishilla can go up front in the field. And let's see, that's theirs for now. There we go. 
it's not familiar with Twitch. Okay, no problems. Okay, uh, press conference. Just want to get to know this this league. Oh, thank you all for joining us. We'll start taking questions now. Just got to focus on playing well. It would just be nice to take on another challenge at another club. Okay, Something we've never done before. We'll just talk about it anyway and see. Where are we in the league? Well, another, another three points would help. Change the squad around a bit. Let's hope that experiment doesn't hurt us today. Arp comes on and scores. Jesus goes off. Arp comes on. Vincentis comes on. Okay, so fine. We won. Main, the most important thing. Okay, let's see now. And to let you know that I no lineup change every week. I need to play more often. But he's not being an idiot again, is he, Gomez? I just had you the other day, the squad man. Oh. Good to see all these guys improving. Um, let's go to our season and let's go to the calendar and November. Oh, we should beat Leverkusen, man, for flip's sake. What's this here? Germany. New Zealand. Let's get us to here. Yeah. Jump this month, come on. That Man United might have been a cup game actually now. We should beat the Cousin guys, come on. We can refocus really on playing some good quality football. This is going on here now. Okay, well, no, just keep the England squad as it is at the moment. No, keep the England squad as it is until such a time where I need to do something different. Um, proud of you. Last couple of game matches, I've tried different tactics, but you still have your place in the squad. Don't worry, okay. Let's change the squad back up again. Um, central. We're not on track. Why are we not on track? Stop that simulation now. Why are we not on track? Talking rubbish. We're going to hit our... Of course we hit our target financially. Don't be dumb. Um... We need to see where we are in the league. First in the league, good. Squad rotation. Essentially, not great. Tomori back in. Give some guys a chance to play for football. Amade in. Where's good? Could do see out for rock. There we go. Nori out left back. Who's gonna put left back for us? Who we got left back? Richer. Richer left to go left back for us. Art back in goal for us. I'm back up front. I can go back up front. Um, Ferguson, Schiller, Asensio, Rada. Where do I click on the member? I don't see to join. What you do, you just go, wait, wait, see where it says subscribe, right? You'll see a little join button that should be there now. You can click that and go to the join button. Click the join there. Yeah. Okay, that should help. Um, Denise, anybody who's a member at the moment, 
let me know what you think of the how the membership's going for you so far. Whether you are seeing a difference in this in 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 the channel, and whether you think that's a a positive or not. I don't have that. I just have subscribe or unsubscribe. No, you should no no you should have a join button. Um, go out to the main page. Go back to the main page. The main YouTube channel page, and you should see it. I had to do it on my laptop, Kenny. Okay. If you go, it should be you could should be, you should be to do it on your YouTube because I can do it on my YouTube as well. If you go to YouTube, on the video on the on a video, it should say subscribe and join. It should be there, right? We need to be beaten. We need to be beating the guys like we need to be beating um, born with guys. Come on. Why are we not on? Why are we not on track? Let me see this a second. Why are we not on track financially? I've got a win. Let's see what we've got here. Office. I only see the bell subscribe and unsubscribe. That's not right. Let's go to Africa. Africa. Uh, let's get Nigerian, Cameroon, Egypt, South Africa, Nigeria, Morocco, we're going to Ghana, Nigeria, we're going to Nigeria, and they give me some physically strong players. Defensively minded. Should be there. Um, let me think. Oh, actually, I know you do it. Go into any of my videos recent times, any of the videos of recent times, there's a link inside the description box. There you go. Look at the link inside the description box of any video. Like if you go to, go to the Clarissa Shields video I did, the preview video. Um, what's an, oh, Denise, what did you think of my uh, video on the Clarissa, the Clarissa Shields fight? Did I not call what Ivana was going to say at the end of the, at the, end of the fight, at the Hello. press conference? Hello, good to see you all here. We're going to take questions one at a time. Please be patient. You'll all get a turn. Are you? Congratulations. If you are a member, I'm going to have to uh, definitely have a look at that. And then after you're a member, I'm going to... I do shout-outs to members, and I will actually... You'll see you'll get different... Shield's too big and too strong for her. Mm. Well, I don't see. I don't subscribe to all of that big, too big, too strong stuff. What I do subscribe to is thank you so much, Cameron. I appreciate you. Really appreciate the support. But now I think at the end of the day, when you are looking at when you look at Shields and you look at Clarissa, uh, Clarissa Shields and um, Ivana Habazan. Too big, too strong? Come on. Um, Ivana Habazan is not a small girl. She's quite a big girl herself. So I don't buy that. What I do buy is if you if you can if you can sit down and look at that fight and you can work out for me what the game plan was from Ivana Habazan, you're a better man than me. Because I said it I've said in the video, you could have pulled anyone out you could have pulled a girl out of the out of the out of the arena, out of the, sitting down, and should have fought Clarissa Shields better. What was that game plan? Okay, if you could work out what that game, I saw for. Yes, yes. Well, that asks you. Yeah, let's go, champ. When Shannon the Cannon gonna get his title shot? Thomas. Uh oh. Uh oh. Everybody. Uh. Joey, if you're in the room, you know what you need to do, son. <laughs> Just keep your eye on Thomas. You know what you need to do, son. Denise, you know what you need to do. Prince, you know what you need to do. Just keep the eyes open. I'm not saying anything anymore. I think I'll let you guys do go to it. Right, we don't need to look at Valencia or Tottenham, honestly. I... <laughs> you 
you know the score now. This is a troll free zone, man. Come on. Ten years of trolling? No, no. We fight back against the trolls, man. Come on. Come on. We fight back against the trolls. Wow. I'm looking forward to this year. Cameron, will you will you make me a promise? Right? You do owe me something. Will you make me a promise? If she's strong enough for Clarissa, why didn't he, he, he punch have any effect? Well, I can tell you a lot of reasons why I punch it down the effect. Well, first of all, when you're ducking your head to the ground, and see, if you're scared, you don't commit with your punches. If you're intimidated, you don't commit with your punches. Um, if you don't believe in what you're doing, you don't commit with your punches. And if you don't, if you're not calm in what you're doing, you don't, you do not throw the same sort of power. Let me tell you something. Look at Chris's shields when she was throwing her punches. Chris was watching her at all times. She's throwing her punches. Even when she threw the left hook to the body and dropped uh, Habazan or Habazin. She was watching her at all times. Watch, watch Ivana for the whole fight. For the most part, her head was down here and she was throwing a punch over here. I mean, yeah, will you, this camera, will you interview my the fighters that I work with in the future? In fact... There's one guy I want you to work with very soon. There's three guys I want you to work with. Three guys. One girl. Alright? But I'd like you to work with them. Well, yeah. There's something I want to talk to you all about tonight while I'm at it, while I'm in, while I'm in the room. A couple of things I want to talk about. First thing I want to talk about while I'm in the room is this. <clears throat> First thing I want to talk about is this. Um, media. I can tell you firsthand, right, that there are the 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 um the PRs, some of the PR people I know for a fact are ruining the reputation of some of our our top fighters today. The PRs, right? They believe this is what I this is what they believe. They believe. That fighters should only talk to big channels and should never talk to small channels. So on a, on a fighter on his way up, he'll build relationship with, with smaller channels, lesser known channels, or sh not sheep-like channels, right? There are channels that attract sheep. And then there are channels who try and stay non-biased and just try and give you the news as it is. What ends up happening is, when these fighters start to make it, and start to make some money and they get PR teams on board what they tell them to do is avoid certain channels literally avoid them back in the queue don't give them the attention but if it wasn't for the smaller channels right some of these smaller channels that make the effort to, to focus on these smaller fighters that's how some of these bigger fighters these smaller fighters get scanned up and picked up I'm telling you this is how they operate this is how they operate Somebody said to me, can you imagine, you think about the amount of people that have come through, I was saying this the other day, Cameron, over on Twitter, uh, Twitch, the amount of fighters that have come through the BWTM window, you think now if they were all fighters, and this is grassroots, so I'm not talking about fighters that have gone on and become world champions and then start interviewing them. You just think about that for a second. Think about if two or three of them were contracted. I know it's hypothetical talk, but if they were any two or three of them were contracted. You've had a unified champion, you've had an undisputed you've had two undisputed champions, Usyk and T and Crawford. You've had unified champions. That happens in all walks of life though. People become snobs with success and look and do look down on others and only search with certain people. Well okay. Well let's talk about that in for a second. The association with some people. I get that. And I've got no problem with that. Let's see where we are in the title. Oh, yes, in a title race. That's what I like to see. I've got no problems with that, right? And I'll tell you why I don't have a problem with it. Because sometimes in life, you do need risk of losing three players. Oh, yeah? Who are the three players we're risking of losing? Nori, Aarons, and Bushilla. Well, that's not going to be happening. So get that sorted now. Um... I believe, well, I could be wrong in this, I agree Kenny, people are some, uh, see some success and they think they're too big for their, okay, alright, 
I'll argue that point. I'll count. I, I see the argument and I agree with that argument there or that, that point of view. I'm going to give you a counter argument to that. I'm going to give you a counter. Let me talk that. A counter argument. So, all right. Birds from a... Okay. Uh, okay. Put it this way. Let's say... The people I'm currently with, in, in the circles I'm with at the moment, they're okay, but they don't understand what it means for me to be a success. So I move with people who understand my vision and understand where I want to be and celebrate me for what I want to be before when I start out. So... I have to change my circles. Like now, I'm changing my circles now. That doesn't mean because it's because it's, it's because I want something that they don't want or they don't see. Sometimes you need to move with certain people to get certain things, and that's not being like a usury. That's more of a case of learning. Like I have to leave. I had to leave primary school to go to secondary school because my education needs were different. I had to move from secondary school to college. Because my needs were different. I had to move from college to university. Right? Because my needs were different. That's not saying that I forgot about primary school. I forgot about secondary school. I had to do it to progression. So it's natural progression. The difference between having natural progression. And just forgetting your roots. There's a difference. When, when you're doing what you're doing. You're, you, you're, you're dismissing the people. And, and looking down on them. While you're being a success. That's, I understand that. Uh, it's different between you dismissing yourself from people who are trying to stop you from being a success. Uh -huh, that's a different conversation. But when you're trying to be a success. And you're trying to better yourself. Then you need to be around people that understand where you're at and where you need to be. That's all. I don't, I don't think there's anything wrong with that. What I do think there's a problem with. Is when you're having that success. And the people that have helped you be a success. Or being an integral part of that success that you chop off and you ignore. I have a problem with that. And that, you know. But then you ask yourself the question, the deeper question. Uh, but do you think interviewing a fighter when they're not known, and but when they're world champion, they don't think you're big enough is, is unfair? Mm. I know... For a fact, fact, that some of these fighters, the majority of these fighters, don't have their own mindset. And their public relations tell them, do not talk to certain people. Do not talk to certain people. Yeah, I've seen them. And these have come out of the mouths of people that have actually helped get to where they are today. So... They do that. They do that. Right? And it's alright saying you're a champion and all that stuff. That's why people like... People knock me for talking for Stavern, yeah? But I respect that guy because he kept it 100% real. And he told me when he was champion that people didn't want me to talk to him. Kept it real. Yo, he got knocked up by Wilder. But champion. Champion because... He was able to stand up for what he believed, regardless of what anybody else thought and believed. Peter Fury is another one. There's a lot of them. Um, I'm sure promoters tell their fighters their big their big name to avoid certain media, unless it's Sky Sports or IFL, if it's Anthony Joshua, etc. Yeah, but that ain't gonna last. That listen, that's to me, that's not gonna last. So what? That's only gonna last if I stay in the position that I'm in at the moment. That's not gonna last. So, wait. So, let me ask you a question. And it's... Uh, if I train a... If I have a bunch of fighters in a stable, yeah? And I say to my stable of fighters, you know what? I don't want you, pay, I don't want you on Sky doing interviews. I don't want you on BBC doing interviews. All the interviews you do are under BWTM. Would I be wrong for doing that? Would I be wrong for doing that? And all those people I know out there at the moment, the PR agencies and what stuff that do those things, would I be wrong? No, Serenko, Serenko's not one of my fighters, one of Bashir's fighters. But I will also say this much. 
I look at what fighters do when they're not next to their trainer. I don't look at what fighters do when they're next to their trainer. I look what fighters do when they're not next to their trainer. I think that's very important. Um, I work with Serenka. I do talk with Serenka, but I don't work with him, no. But there is a fighter that I am going to be working with. It's going to surprise a lot of people. There's about three or four fighters I'm going to start working with. Uh, and then... Eventually... Eventually... I will start training fighters. That is my next goal. That's my next goal. So I definitely am going to do that's definitely one of my next goals. Definitely. This year. So I've got a lot of work to do still, but Thank you everyone for joining us. We're gonna start questions now. I would I don't know because I don't really talk with her anymore, like since nothing personal, I just don't talk with them no more. Um I would not be surprised though. I would not be surprised. But check this out. Okay guys. Two girls that I know that have been on our channel that have gone on and ended up working for top rank. Two of them. Melissa being one and who and the girl from Australia is another. Both girls are now working for top rank. Isn't that interesting? It's interesting, huh? That's a bad defeat. What would I say to Habazan? <sighs> I think I did it. I did it. Uh, I, I answered that question inside the uh, the post fight video I did. But uh, I would be asking a very serious question. And my question to her would be. Yeah, it does look like serious business. Um, my question to her would be very simple a very simple one um where do you see yourself in the world of boxing one two um why are you boxing and three the reality that at top level your current mindset and application isn't effective enough to be a world champion that's what I would say so I'm talking from a NLP background back uh, perspective I'm talking from a coaching perspective and I know I'm talking as a trainer perspective because if you're asking me if I'm his her trainer or her manager I would be looking to see progression from this point onwards that sometimes people get a beating so bad or get so badly embarrassed that it changes them yeah how long before ultimate team people Um, yes, it will do. You said an hour 30 minutes ago. Thank you very much for that. Um,
isn't it fair to say not having Bashir in the corner messed everything up? Are the um yeah if you if you now go to on the channel itself you'll see membership members only you'll see all the videos there eventually we'll get to a point where very soon no Bashir after the fight surprised uh no because I believe Bashir was backstage wrapping our hands but no I'm not surprised because the legal He's, he's taken a legal a lawsuit against Showtime and against a promoter and against uh, Clarissa. So, you know. Ah, yes, it says C Perks now. There you go. So, you'll see in there. And then what the other thing in the membership is, please, if you remember, go and check the area where it says... Um, where it's go to the wait where you got on YouTube go to community yeah um I don't know what happened there I heard that he was backstage I don't know he he said he was with uh, Ivana but I don't think it would have made a difference because you got to listen to your trainer I don't think it would have made a difference I don't think it would have made a difference in fact it sounds bad but I'm glad he, uh, James Ali Bashir was not connected with that fight in that sense I'm glad because if it was me oh I will do but I'm not gonna ask him today I'm not gonna ask him today are you crazy you must really be crazy you must want me to get cussed out I'm gonna ring Bashir now and ask him his thoughts you must think I'm gonna get cussed out hey that's the second fight that's done that team by the way the second fighter that's done that to him. Or do I have to remind you who the first fighter was? Do you remember who the first fighter was? Do you remember who the first fighter was that did that stuff? I bet you can't even remember. Oh. There's a guy you need to be keep, keeping your eyes on. No. The first... Do you think she could have waited a bit longer till fighting to go and use more no 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 because you've got you got to remember you for me you've got to listen to your trainer do you really think oh, sky looks good do you really think honestly based on habazan's skill set Do you really think on Habazan? Yeah. Do you really think that Habazan skill set was enough to beat Clarissa Shields? She wasn't going to beat for me. She wasn't going to beat Clarissa Shields on her skill set. The way she would have had to beat Clarissa Shields, like I broke it down to you, she would have had to close Clarissa Shields down, give her no space, and then rough her up. That's the only way she would have beaten Clarissa Shields. She could not have beaten Clarissa Shields, in my opinion, standing back and using a jab. It wasn't Eddie Chambers. It was um, wasn't Eddie Chambers. The the guy who was training him was um, Steve Upshare. Steve uh, Eddie Chambers' brother. Some good players here, man. Before this fight, never seen or heard of Habazan. Only heard of her because, but she was trainer. Yeah, and that's by association, isn't it? By association, of course. I get that. I get that. Another guy you need to look out for. He's on the channel now. His name is Justin Jones. Heavyweight. Unbeaten. 23-0. Jewel breaker. Come on, we've got to beat Watford. Oh, Aisu scoring, Gomez scoring. Well, who's Bashir going to work with? He, Bashir might probably, probably won't be working with any of those fighters. Will he? Until those injuries clear up. Mm. 
Hmm. Well, you might have hit the nail on the head there, my friend. You may have hit the nail on the head there, my friend. You may have hit the nail on the head. It's not for me to say that, but... Clearly... What made you think? What made you think that though? What made you come to that conclusion? She clearly got over over all the. She clearly got over all the drama. Fast also. She should have been demanding for Bashir never mentioned him fast I'm aware well I did say that I felt that she fought with a lack of passion but she fought with a lack of passion it was a you know, a lack of passion. I don't know if it's because she didn't get paid enough. I, I don't, I don't know. But she certainly fought lack of, with a lack of passion. I'm not making excuses, but it's close between us. She just seems the type. Uh, she just seems the type to be ignorant. And deep down, it was her payday, payday for her. Well, I've spoken to. Her off the camera for quite a while I think sometimes people think they know better and sometimes in boxing you have to take a beating to understand that I hope Serenko doesn't become a sensation like Usyk and get a team that wants Bashir out always possible not running her down but Bashir was and is too good for her yeah well well I know what the plan was between well I can reveal what the plan was now the plan was I think so too Danny the plan was with Bashir and myself now before this Habazan Clarissa Shields fight was meant to happen yeah of course he did the plan was for Bashir and myself to do we were going to do a tour of the UK boxing masterclass in the UK he was going to do a tour I was going to manage that tour and then the Shields uh, thing fight happened answers if Bashir was in that corner would the no no don't think Bashir would have made a difference don't think Bashir would have made a difference and I love uncle wouldn't have made a difference because ultimately it doesn't matter if it's Bashir, Jesus Christ, Buddha, Muhammad, uh, Hare Krishna, Gandhi, Malcolm X, uh, Boris Johnson, Donald Trump. It doesn't matter who's in her corner. A uh, customato. If you don't listen, you don't listen. You don't listen. So, I, I, I don't care who's in the corner. There's some things, some things, it don't matter. Some people, like, it was like in cricket. As some people, you will tell a guy, listen, I want you to go out and bat today. I want you to take your time and get some, take your time in the crease. Don't rush it. Don't go out and play silly shots. You know, take your time. Take a look at the bowling. And then, first time he sees the first decent ball, he goes out there, and no, Adam Booth would have made Adam Booth would have made it worse. Adam Booth would have made it worse. What? What? Listen, what has Adam Booth done? Please tell me. Have you ever seen Adam Booth in a situation where his fighters not doing very well, and they've been able to switch up the game plan? Have you ever seen Adam Booth change switch up a game plan? Have you ever seen Adam Booth switch up a game plan? Just answer me that question. Adam Booth. Have you seen Adam Booth switch up a game plan? All you have to do is look at David Hay when he fought Klitschko. 
No, I think what it was, I think what it was about Booth that made everyone talk about Booth so much is that he had a degree in psychology or something like that. That's what it is. And he was very, he, he, he picked his fighters correctly. Well, he got Hay and he got Groves. Two guys who were pretty nimble on their feet and could punch. Yeah? That's what we like to see. So. Oh dear. So I'm not. You can't knock Adam Booth. I mean, he's done what he's doing. But when you turn around, and you try and tell us. If we, when you try and sit down and tell me that Josh Kelly was the best fight you've ever trained. Well, who are you trying to fool there? Josh Kelly is the best fight you've ever trained. Come on. Thank you, lads. Josh Kelly is the best fight, you, most skill fight you've ever trained. And you. People like Danny Brown believe this. No, oh, he's a beast at cruiserweight. I tell you, he was a beast at cruiserweight. Carl Thompson. Ingram, wonder how many times Bashir spoke to Habazan since the incident. Yeah, quite a lot. I spoke to Bashir nearly every nearly every day after that incident. Nearly every single day, and it was it was painful watching him. So painful. So painful. So, so painful. So painful. Well, I, I don't know if I'm managing here, but I just, I'm just a person he can talk to. Let's put it this way. The person he can talk to and if he needs, you know, Not that he needs me, man, but I just talked to Bashir. I think Bashir, I don't know. I don't know what to say. But um, I certainly, certainly uh, would like, uh, well, he said to me already, he'll mentor me. So if I, if I, I want him to mentor me. So I want him to be my boxing mentor, coach mentor. So I want to go for a pro license and I want Bashir to mentor me. Why do people never talk about Carl Thompson in the cruiserweight division? Yeah, of course it, of course it is. Rog, I talked about this before. Should I sell him? And uh, yeah, I think the time has come. Uh, we're going to negotiate this. The Rog's got to go. He's 80, 30. I think it's time for him to go. Sadly. Listen, 20 million, 22 million. If you buy 22 million, you can have him. No, 22 million. See, even now, Rog's my boy. He's not progressing, but 22 million. You don't want him, you can go. Well, sorry, then uh, bye. I love Rog. Love a bit of Rog, so I'm sorry, bye. I do want to sell Rog, but... Can we get a, re a move on this season in a second? Canada. Oh. Yeah, he lives in the US. He lives in a place called uh, New Jersey. Which isn't too far from Atlantic City. Bashir can't fly anywhere at the moment. He has to stay... Uh, grounded basically because of the injury he's still got blood on the brain so No, it's not good at all. But um, I would love to get the chance to be able to train with Bashir. Like, I think it's the best. 
Um, how many people can say, how many professional traders can say they've been trained with, trained or learnt their trade with James Ella Bashir? I think it's incredible. The same tutelage or the same, and the same mindset of Emmanuel Stewart. Patience. We're going to start taking questions now. I think it's a great thing, you know, a great opportunity. He's been treated in boxing That's and no main... That's all time for today. Thanks for coming, everyone. Yeah, of course not. But that's a political thing. That just shows you the face of boxing and what boxing's about. To be honest. Well done, boys. 1-0. Who scored it? Done this. Just need to keep winning, boys. Keep winning. Transfer market. Have I got any money to buy a big player? Let's see. Seven million. No, forget it. If that incident had happened to someone like Tony Sims or to Paul Gallagher or John Gallagher have been all over the I know. So you just know what the sport's about. I told you, man, we know what the sport's about, so it happened to Gallagher, there would have been a <laughs> Yeah, of course it would have been. Should we loan Janssen out for the season, people? That's a big one. To loan out Janssen. Justin Janssen. Or do we keep him in-house? You think we should loan Janssen out? 16 years old. And he's 73. Worth 7 million. 73. 16 years old. I mean, he might he, he might come in handy at the cha transfer chance. No, I'm keeping him. I just don't trust this thing with the Champions League, so I'm going to keep him. I'm not going to. You know, in the past we've had knackered players, Champions League time. Yeah, but you know what that's all about, don't you? As Bashir said, if he was a bootlicker, it'd have been different altogether. Yeah, I am looking forward to this season and seeing where, exactly where what happens this season in boxing for me. I really do. I'm excited. So we can get something else. Oh, it's no, no. Well, <laughs> no. I think, uh, if I'm honest with you, uh, I haven't been successful. I have been a betting man, though. Ingram, what's happening with this so-called boxing game mean to be coming out? Good question. Um, <clears throat> I think what's happened with them is that they've had problems with people saying promises and then have not delivered. I think another thing is they've changed developers. So that's another thing as well. They've had new developers recently. They made an announcement of new developers. I'm not in control of that, you know what I mean? I just said I would back it and support it because it was boxing and... They were doing a good thing, and I thought, well, you know what, I would, I'd back it and support that. So that's where we're at with that. I don't. 70... Oh, look at this as a goalkeeper, six two, sixteen years old. Yeah, we'll have you. Yeah, we'll have you too. No, 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 no. No, I don't think it's dead. I don't think it's dead at all. Come on. Nope. 
It's Champions League, come on, let's see where we are off this season. Let's get, let's, let's get where we are in the season now. Oh! Paris Saint-Germain, Champions League. <laughs> the Quendo, you jokers. No investor, I had my doubts from the start about it. No, people have invested or have been investing. So, I don't, the doubt, investing side is not the problem. But there are things you need more than just investment. You need people who are going to make the game and designs. And it's not easy. It's not easy. Not easy at all. I heard Eddie Hearn was trying to get himself involved at some point. But you know where he got that idea from. But anyway. Right. Champions League. Paris Saint-Germain. We've got to get it right now. Uh, do, I, do I sim the first half? No, you just got to keep confident. You've got to be positive, man. I still posit I stay positive about it. But, you know, well, I'll tell you one upset. What, um, what update I can give you, and this is quite exclusive. People might not know about it. Uh, uh, Jeff, Lacey, Jeff Lacey, since I spoke to you, he has now become homeless. The, some sort of scam happened and now he's been made homeless yep so not great paid for everything and he found it as a scam somebody else owns the house that's not good not at all yeah yeah didn't know that did you hey I heard about it and um, I was devastated when I heard about it. Now he doesn't want to discuss it, but I, I, I actually got, I got upset, and in the end, I end up, rem I, I, I end up leaving, removing Jeff Lacey from my page, because I'm like, hold on a second, you're on the page, saying to people, oh, the media don't care, I didn't get any media coverage for it, and then when I go to talk to you about it, you're like, oh. You didn't want to talk to me about it. So I thought, all right. It seems to me that you're. it's more about making some money on this situation. So I just del I, I deleted him off my page. I, del I literally deleted Jeff Lacey off my page. Just for that, I thought, no. Sorry. Can't be having that nonsense going on. No. I interviewed you. I was interviewing you. I did interview you when nobody was caring about you and your career. And we did an interview to put it right about you and, and Kawasaki. I mean, you're comfortable to talk to me about that. He said it isn't in interest in the UK media. He said he wants the dollars for it. Well, okay. Cool. Well, it, it, you know. Merci pour votre patience. Nous allons passer aux questions. He should know better. He should know better because when his fight, when nobody paid attention to his fight, Um, and it, with the Tony Oko fight, we covered that fight. You know what I mean, I don't, I'm not interested in that really. I just let's see what we've got. I want to make sure my squad's right for this. We got Gomez, Uzi. Yeah, I think we'll do. Although, yeah, it was on my Facebook page. I just haven't got time for that anymore, man. I really haven't. You're on the page moaning about how media don't care about your career and don't care about your life. And then when media do approach you, tell them you're not interested. No. That means you're just moaning and complaining. No, I can't have that on my page, man. It's not good. Not healthy. Can't be doing that stuff, man. That's one of the things we talked about earlier on about associating with people that... Because you'll do it, you'll just keep moaning and moaning. What really is about is about money. So, I tell you who did the same thing. Riddick Bow had the same approach as well. When Riddick Bow wanted a bit of money, well, he did the same thing. What we have in store for you today: the hype has been building all week, and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay tuned. We'll have all the action for you live on EA TV. And probably the reason, the reason why mainstream media didn't want to know about it, because he was charging. That's why. 
And good evening to there you go. The Parc des Princes here in the French capital. Oh, waste your time. The venue for tonight's action. Oh, waste your time. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me here on the commentary box for complete coverage is Lee Dixon. We've got action from the round of 16 in the Champions League um, to bring you. It's Paris Saint Germain up against Portsmouth. Well, I, I had an interview, yeah, that was set up with um, Hank Lundy. And he bailed out on the interview with me. When he said he was going to do the interview. Bailed out when I was meant to do the interview live. And guess who called me the next day after that? Muhammad Ali's brother. True story. Down to the last 16 teams, Derek. The cream normally starts to rise to the top at this stage. Big teams will start to show their hands. But I'm sure there'll still be a few upsets. Round of 16, a very different feel. That's what I've said. Like a different tournament in some respects, Lee. Well, it is. We're into knockout football, and the pressures that comes with is completely different than when you play in the group stages, Derek. It really is. Players have to switch on. No mistakes. You're not allowed mistakes at this level. Yeah. Introducing the Paris Saint Germain starters. Daniele Rugani starts with Andreas Christensen in central defence. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. Well, that's what Christensen is all about. Good read. Well, let's dissect the Portsmouth starting 11. What a shocking pass, really. Always difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game, but you could make a strong case for this man, Lee. What are you anticipating seeing from him? Well, how do you stop him? Four goals in three games. I suggest the defence. They could nudge in front. A brisk start and a quick goal. Well, the manager would have said, keep it tight at the back and see if we can nick an early goal. And they certainly have done. Well, as we see, it's a great cross, but what a finish. So hard to wait and be patient when the ball's dropping. He does Aww. everything right and finishes it off. A brilliant goal. Got to win the Champions League tonight, boys. So I win that Champions League and leave in Portsmouth. Win the Champions League and the, and, and the, and the title. Kian. Here's Mbappe. Well, many oh. people have wanted to have their say on the subject of Ander Herrera in the build-up to this match. And the reports have been confirmed. He's decided to end what has been a brilliant career at the end of this season. A huge loss for the club, you've got to say, Lee. Well, how do you feel that, Cap Derek? Such a great player, a senior pro. Pros like him with his CV are worth a waiting goal, a manager's dream. He'll be sadly missed. This is Neymar. Bentancur with it. Do you know, I've never managed a Barcelona or Real Madrid for some reason. I don't know what that reason is. Gomez. N never ever managed one of those teams. When Always Dizzy. manages Vinicius Junior. Middle of the road side. Showing fine vision. He's gone for power lead, but it's wide. Well, no real direction, but the power was there. And you're right, it's just gone past the post. Yeah, it's a shame when that happens. On the yeah, ball. I did an interview with George Foreman's brother. And the ball with Christensen. No, his son. Diogo Dallo. Varela has it. And now it's and, um, That was something. Mbappe with it. He did one interview with me. He talked about Keith Thurman. He talked about how they were rushing Keith Thurman. And I never heard from him again. Huh. Almada. An important interception. Yeah. I got fed up of doing it. I do get fed up of doing the interviews, so I just keep it tight with people that I kind of like. I interview people that I like Almada. now, or people I've got a real interest in now. Whereas before, I just interviewed anybody and everybody. Almada. People I got real interest with and that I can do something with. Is it going to be? Well, the clearance half-hearted, and he clears it out of harm's way. No, come way. on, man! I can't do Arsenal again. Boring Arsenal, man. I did it, and I did after with the uh, PS20, right? And now it's with Embolo. Be nice it's to go really to a club that. Attack. What will they do next? Counter, boys. Counter. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. Almada. 
Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. End product or not, can he put it away? A very high degree of difficulty for any goalkeeper. Sheer quality, quality of the shot and certainly quality of the save. Let's give you a save or... Gomez. Yeah. It's opening up for them. Clever defensive play, Christensen. No, absolutely not. Neymar, well, he was in the right place to intercept. Mbappe with it. Yeah, I think if you yard a few, a couple, I think if you want. Real Embolo. No, he wants. No, he wants it. Can they trouble the defence? <laughs> <laughs> well, they did have possession of the ball. Oh, no. Nah. Good work. Nah, I had my chance with Lennox Lewis and he, he blew it with me. He so. might be able to profit from the wide position. Fine cross into the middle. It's in. They're looking really relaxed and confident. And not giving the opposition much of a look in. Well, here's the replay. Here's the value of crosses. And when they come in like this, almost teed up on a plate. He swings his boot and it catches it absolutely perfect. What a finish. So, 2 nil now. Well, if... He, well... And so the half-time whistle has gone. If Lewis is, pe is paid by PBC, then you tell me... <laughs> you know... Um, you know, this football game is going pretty good at the moment, you know. Uh, and they begin the second half in the you know, first leg of this Champions of League really round well. of 16 time. You know, they, they, you know they, they're playing good football, Gomez, good soccer, Almada. and uh, yeah, you know, I wish Vinicius the team all Junior. the best. You know, I wish they were, it was West Ham, because you know, I was a West Ham boy good back in the day, you know. But, um, He's just got to continue his run. It has to you know, be. if I so ever see with it bowl, I'm going to well, slap that boy. <laughs> Ever see with it bowl? I'ma slap that boy. <laughs> you know. No Linux, I don't know, but you know. <laughs> oh dear me now. My focus has gotta come on then. Yeah. Defenders defend, goalkeepers make saves like that. He's Get on that. In the corner. Go on, just just unable to take advantage of that developing Get situation. Get three or four goals and we're better than difficulty keeping the ball. We need to get another goal. Confident the with the ball at his feet. Play one leg. Him. Let him go. Go on. This is the home of live football, EA TV, and we'll have live coverage of the fifth round of the FA Cup. It's Portsmouth oh, no. taking on Liverpool. Yeah, for me, play. now starting to get to the nervy part of the competition. 16 teams left in it. Who will last the pace? Can't wait for that, Derek. Ferguson. And now, passing it through. Gabriel Jesus in position oh. back post here. Great chance with that header, but he sent it wide of the post. Well, it's quite easy to head that one over the bar. This time he just gets his angles wrong, just past the Guys, post. Guys, I was going to ask you, ladies and gentlemen, what are your thoughts on uh, this Portsmouth team, by the way? How do you think they're looking? And 30 minutes left for play in this Look, match. It's not, it's nobody's mentioned anything about the new players that have come to the club. The cross is on. Well, it was pretty straightforward for the goalkeeper. What are you doing? Oh, he's given the ball away. Oh, it's an unbelievable save by Courtois. Epic line. Played into the centre of the box. You know, he's look at the state of his face. It, firing it in. Look at the state of his face, you know. No contest, see? Definitely more competitive than previous seasons. Well... We got to the semi quarterfinals, semi finals of, of the of the Champions League. Only to get done by Real Madrid I think in the penalty on penalties. What can they do from this particular position? Oh! Well, the header that was frankly miles off target. We need to get a third goal, boys. That was, um, awful. We need to get a third goal, boys. Come on. 
get that third goal and put this game to bed. Yeah, let him go. Good vision from Gabriel Jesus. Might be able to get in behind the defence. He's got to score! Can he take advantage? It really is such a free-scoring performance. Just nothing the defenders can do about it, seemingly. Rock. Yes, Joshua. Thank you for acknowledging that. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I know. Thank you. You can always be guaranteed that Joshua will let you know exactly where you, your shortfalls are. <laughs> oh. oh, come on. Can you get a fourth goal here? A fourth goal will end this game and we can just go through to the next round. Because I'm not playing the second leg of this. That's why I want to get a fourth goal. Come on. Oh. Moise Kayan. What was Moses Keane his name was? Watch it! Let's get that fourth goal. Come on. A fourth goal kills this game off completely. Diogo Dallo on the ball. Yeah, I do remember that. Do you know what? I can't it's see. I can't see the fight. Seem to find that fight anywhere between um, Akin One Day and John Fury anywhere. What Sam? Gabriel Jesus. A really sumptuous ball. The goals keep going in for them. I don't think they're going to throw this away now. Absolutely omnipotent. Omnipotent. Have you ever heard of a football team being called omnipotent? Top marks, finishing at his best. Lovely through ball as well. The timing was perfect. Excellent finish. I think well, Akin one day knocked out John Fury, or he stopped him. They now have been yeah, Akin one day he stopped or knocked out John Fury. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. Moise Kean. He has been deemed to be offside, not by Muchley. Brilliant, it's not in Moses Keane, it's Moise Kane. Spot on. I thought his name was Moses Keane. His name is Moise Kane. Oh boy. And there goes the final whistle. It's a victory for the visitors in the first leg of this time. Uh. Yep, I'm sure he can. Well, who's going to argue with him? I'm not arguing with all that. If he believes that, let him believe that. I'm not going to say, oh, by the way, mate, just to let you know, John. And he's a nice guy, John. He's a very nice guy. Sat next to him when uh, Huey Fury fought. Uh, the war machine. Voilà. I thought it was stopped. Okay. I wouldn't either. I like John. He just he just tells it like it is. And as Gal was on earlier on today on online, and he was talking about he was hyping up the Billy Joe Saunders fight with Canelo. <laughs> That's not good. I call that fight lamb to slaughter. People think I'm joking about that. <laughs> it wasn't Billy Joe Saunders that selected Canelo now, remember this. It was Canelo that selected Billy Joe Saunders. And there's a big difference in that. I remember you did a show once with Asgar and the chat was just ripping him. I loved it. Yeah. Yeah, they do do that. I don't know, but you see the thing is now. You know, I... Cameron, I've changed so much. I think I've changed so much now. Like, certain things don't matter to me anymore. Like, 
there's something that just don't matter. Maybe I'm getting older, but something just don't matter anymore. Of course, I wouldn't say it's leagues above. I think that uh, Billy Joe Saunders is a sitting duck now. That's what I do know. Quite lit figuratively, and sit he is a sitting duck. All that, all those years he's been talking. Now he gets the opportunity to back it all up, innit? Yeah, there's competition. Of course there's competition. I don't talk crap. You've got Charlo, you've got Andrade. That's two fighters you can have competition with. I'd love to see a, I'd love to see Charlo and um Big Charlo and the Canelo fight. Yes, of course he stops cat. Of course he does. Of course he does. Come on, man. What kind of question is that, Cameron? You should know better. Cameron Smith can only fight on the front foot. That's why I told everybody that Ka late. No, he doesn't stop him late. He stops him early. He stops him inside six. Inside six. Because what's Cameron Smith going to do? Killer is going to walk him down, walk him to the ropes. Cameron Smith will tuck up on the ropes like this. And when Callum Smith sits on ropes, he can't fight back. He just does that. He just tucks up and goes into a ball. And then just Canelo's going to rip that body. And he'll bring it through the middle. He'll knock Smith out, man. He'll beat the crap out of Smith. Smith can't fight off the back foot. That's why I knew John Ryder was going to beat him. The way you beat Callum Smith, you put him on the back, put his back against the ropes, keep his back against the ropes for 12 rounds, you beat Callum Smith. That's why I knew John Ryder would beat Callum Smith. No, John Ryle is not domestic. John Ryle's domestic level. So, so what does make what makes Callum Smith so spectacular? Because Eddie Hearn tells you he is. Callum Smith is a is a, is a I call opportunist. Listen, I like Callum Smith, right? There ain't nobody in the world of boxing that walks like Callum Smith. Hi guys, thank you all for coming. We'll start taking questions now. They should call it the Callum Smith walk. Okay, the Callum Smith walk. I love Callum. There's like the two walks in boxing that I love. The Callum Smith walk and the, the, the George Groves walk. No, mate. You know that fight's not going to happen, mate. You know that fight's not going to happen. So I don't even know why you're talking about it. It's not happening, mate. Would you pay to watch Anthony Yard fight fight him? Let me ask you a question. Would you pay to watch Kalala fight Anthony Yard? What I don't want to see is Anthony Yard, because he fought well and decent against Canelo. Uh, I mean, I don't want to see him now fighting against um, the top-ranked fighters. I really don't. Yeah, I like Groves. Groves had a great entrance. He had a fabulous entrance. But like I said, you've got to do the Callum. You got to be able to do the Callum Smith walk though. I hope that Anthony Yard doesn't become a nearly man like Michael Watson. Come on, Portsmouth. Ah, Portsmouth. Man, we've got to score more goals, guys. Come on. Can't be drawing them games, man. Man City versus... Oh, boy. You see, there you go again. Kenner would wreck him. Really? This is Danny, you're the guy, the same guy that turned around and said that John Ryder was domestic level. I think so too. I think you should rebuild. You're the same guy that said John Ryder was domestic level, man. Come on. You've got to, you've got to start learning from boxing, man. And these fights, you can't keep making these reckless statements. Get this team together. Asus cannot be playing this game. Sorry. Just no. You're not playing this game. That's it. We're now a murder back in the side as well. That's why our team scores goals. Um, come on, guys. You need to win this game. 
Let's beat Man City, please. Go through to the next round. I love you for it, man. Just beat Man City now. Please. We're a much better team than Man City. Come on. Yes. Gomez getting goal in that 108th minute for us. Brilliant. 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 Yeah, well, that's a good question. Champions League. We're not watching this game. After smashing them 4-0. We shouldn't have to play. Watch them. We're definitely watching that game. No, we're not watching this game. Sorry. Might even rest and play some other players in this game instead. Chelsea are out. Oh, we'd have to play Barcelona again. Let's see, Jansen on loan. Player chat, that's who's talking. Okay. Yep. Get you playing against Paris then, mate. You want to play against Paris? You'll get to play against Paris, no problems. Going with scoring goals for us, Rog will get to play. Up will come off. Asus will play. Ferguson will play. Bushilla will play. Defence. Uh, who's another defender? Bell. What Oh well. Yeah, uh, I don't think Bratz is very good. I don't think Bratz is very good at all. I've said that already. I think Bratz is. Uh, my missus has woke up and said. What? Thank you everyone for Why do you always listen to that man? Haha. -ha. I'm not that bad, ma'am. I'm not that bad. Tell her, when you tell her, tell her that uh, the reason why you listen to me is because you're going to bring more money into the household. That's what it is. As soon as you say that, she'll be happy. Most women are. I've never heard a woman say yet that she's not happy that her man's bringing in more money to the household. That that man, you know. Hey, yo, you ought to tell your missus who that man is. Or maybe she said the man. You see, it might have been the man. You see? Why are you listening to the man? <laughs> see? Might be a Hampshire thing, you know. What? 73-70? Oh, Man City are going to win the title. We don't want that. Oh my god, Man City are going to win the title. The disrespect, lol. There you go, Joshua there. But needs more learning. <laughs> Come on, we've got to beat West Ham here. Oh, that was brutal. Who scored all them goals? Rodrigo, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Oh. Look, I don't... Trust me, she has listened to a lot of boxing channels since I met her. And she likes Ingram. She hasn't moaned once about it. Usually does. Oh, thank you. Well, I do appreciate it, ma'am. I do appreciate but um you know maybe she, I, 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 I think I, I think I quit while I'm ahead uh you know what angel go angel or angel Gomez is really annoying because every time he's complaining about four points between us and city winning the title oh, but I don't know who have we got now in the league? Who is this now we're playing? Who is this team next? England. Oh, I don't care about England. I don't really don't care. No, I don't care. Thank you. I appreciate that, Cameron. What's going on here? Right. 
I don't care about England. I don't care if someone's got a broken toe or broken foot. I don't care. Who have we got next? France. I don't care about Czech Republic. Man City. Oh, we've got to beat Man City. We have to beat Man City. So, who's next in the league? Lille. We should beat Lille, man. We should beat Lille. We should beat Lille. And I've got, we've got to beat Man City as well. To win the title, we have to beat Man City. Now, do I simulate that? Well, I may as well. We have to beat Man City. It's a crucial game. Okay, thanks for waiting. We can make a start now. Well, there's an opportunity there to win the league right now. I mean, well, a month, less than a month okay. away from the from the winning the league. So I mean, do we, okay? Do we play the game or do we see the game against Man City? There's four points in it. We beat Man City. We close the gap down to one point. Yeah, I heard about that. Do we play it or do we sim it, guys? If we play it, play it. Okay. Let's change the squad round then. Jesus is out. Up in. Um. We need Armada in if he's fit. Is he not there? No, he's not there. Do we need you back on the side? Definitely. Def right, okay. I'm gonna drop rock. I can play Gomez. I think that's a resounding play, right? <coughs> a resounding play. I put Collado in here as well. Okay. Think about all those youth players who've gone out and loan for the season. Got to win this game. We win this game. We're a point. There must be something about that though. Yeah, I will be. Definitely. Definitely. You know, I, I, I knew something was up about Josh Taylor when they uh, did that thing about him in the pub. And then days later, he left Matchroom. Did you notice? Is it Matchroom he left? Yeah, it was, it was, it was surprising. Two terrific teams in action here. Both of them in with a chance of winning the title. What Makes you wonder, will isn't it? be really important. We're moments away from the kickoff it may, it at the Etihad Stadium. <laughs> and it's live. It makes you wonder Welcome whether... To to it just makes you wonder whether that stuff that came out of Josh Taylor actually did happen. Or it was part of character assassination because he was leaving Matchroom. You do look. He le They say what they say about him. And days later he's at top rank. So they must have known he was leaving for top rank. That's what I think. To the Etihad Stadium here in Manchester. Dirty business boxing. Martin Tyler here along with Alan Smith. Premier League football is coming right up for you. Manchester City against Portsmouth. Yeah, real buzz around this ground. Full house. A lot of interest in it. Hope it doesn't disappoint. Here's Hernandez. Now Grimaldo. Manchester City's lineup today. The goalkeeper is Edison. Lucas Hernandez plays alongside Yerimina hey. in yo, 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 yo. Yo, yo, yo. Front. yo, 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 He really gave it the laces there, didn't he, Alan? Yeah, he did connect with it beautifully. Not a bad effort at all. Wake up, wake up, wake up, guys. One point. Win this game is one point, guys. One point. We are playing for high stakes here, Alan. Oh, they are down there, and uh, it's a match with to guiding it through. Oh, what a goal! And look what's happened.
Brisbane. We've seen that goal, and it's really been coming right from the kickoff. What a goal! One of my best ever. That's one of my best ever goals. Well, it was Look at a this. Decent move and to get some space in a crowded penalty area. Not meant to keeper. Not meant to keep us. Look at this. Well worth analysing again. <laughs> <laughs> not meant to keep her. Have it. Well, not what he was looking for. And the manager now looking less than pleased. Somebody's going to pay for that uh, goal they've just conceded. Well, uh, really? Portsmouth have the lead. Really? Somebody's going to pay for it? If you say so. It's our season, son. We need to win the league. They should do, innit? And I might keep them getting sold off for that. <laughs> they have been sold off for that. In terms of possession, can they find the final pass? Nothing. No, they can't. Get there. Get there. Let's go. Go on. Oh, okay. <coughs> Going forward well. Well, they've got the opposition on the back foot with this break. No, we haven't. Coming at them with numbers. Go on. Go on. I'm either. Oh. Oh, lucky. Couldn't keep it. I love the accelerator we've got now on our wingers. I'm invested in our wingers. Like this, all they can do is just clear Alan? The lines no more. Come in, mate. Quick -witted. I'm live, but come in anyway. In movement too, to intercept there. <laughs> Run it back with an interception. No. Cool. Yeah. I'm live playing football. Well, <coughs> Still got a bit to do, but this is promising. Good width in the attack here, looking for a cross at the end. Of it. Saved by the keeper. You can't Feel hang free, on to mate. This just drink in the fridge. Yeah. What's Nevis. that? Here's Hernandez. What's that? No, it's dark and now. Flick the light on then. Sorry? Turn the light on. Hold on a second, people. I need to turn the light on. You got it? Yeah. Good. Right, back. Sorry about that, people. I have my friend Alan, who's with me at the moment. He's staying a, a few days. He's coming, come, come over from Ireland. I think some of you might remember him. Alan, he did a, we did a, a couple of boxing videos with him. Leroy Sane. Just caught in two minds, I think, the attacking team there. Oh! The defender wasn't. It's good attacking play this from them. Wonderful chance. Policy. Well, it's a penalty. And the referees added to their problems. Yeah, lost the composure, haven't they? It's been a poor day and it's only going to get worse here. Penalty has been awarded by the referee. And he's sent right, off now, the offender here, that? Alan. Rodrigo. Yeah, it's a double whammy, isn't it, for this side now. A man down and looks like they're going to concede to... Oh, what we're doing? He's got it all wrong with the penalty. God. Oh, that was a shocker. I think the nerves got He kicked it. The five in a chanting. Oh, oh, my God. He's the net, but he's missed it by a couple of yards. I didn't even push the button. I didn't even know there was a time limit. All right, I'll pay for that. Able to make the interception. I don't know what that was penalty all about. At Anfield, Alan McInally is there. It's a penalty for Wolverhampton. Wanderers. I didn't even know that. I've been looking he's to do... The ball down on the spot. City will pay for that, trust me. Oh, nice one. Oh, he's hit the post and it's gone back out the way. It's missed. 33 minutes played. It remains 1-0. And now the shot. That's great defending with the block. A little bit of surprise. The visitors with less possession here. They've done so well. They've got some quick players in this team and they broke out of defence with such pace. The manager will be delighted. The right, game plan is working perfectly. Oh. Getting the ball back and thinking attack straight away. Well, it could be in. Clear opportunity. A really incisive breakaway. Held his position, stayed on side, in at the keeper, but he's denied him. Oh, he's such a good keeper in these situations. Right, you know, cough is coming cool, from. And he got his angles absolutely correct now. Only partially away from danger. It's not a nice cough, is it, guys? Let's be honest. Not a good cough. 
So. Gomez. Has a go here. Oh. Amada's a beast. Joey, I tell you, Armada is a great signing. He's put in the corner. it goes to the back of his heel neatly done must score that could be a game-winning moment to go two in front now the league could be won tonight lads oh, what a time to get a goal just before half time their manager's team talks just changed a bit there i was at i was hesitant but I had faith. Half time. So I, I knew you weren't putting me in the wrong. You wouldn't put me in the wrong place. So I want to hit some of these players off because I don't want them more playing all the time. I want to give these guys rest. Let's put you on here. Rog. I know you're leaving at the end of the season, so put him there. Um, let's be focused on. Tighten their fence up. I see. So I'm going to ask you. Are there any other players that you've been interested in since we've uh, any players that I've bought that you've been interested in or you've seen or you like? Oh, he's cut it out. There should be gaps open up in the second half for us. I love Gaduzzi, you know. It's Bernardo Silva. Oh, oh! they find the final pass? Wanted to go for the strength in the shot, but he needed some direction. Yeah, I mean, if you don't shoot, you don't. Did score, you know? He's got to do much better. That you can actually do live streams, private store live for streams. You. Coverage on EA Sports of the Premier League fixture. This might be it. Oh, he made that look like a poor pass with a very good interception. Yeah, I got him for 30 million. After Release this, course. the visiting team are involved in this fixture in the Premier League. And who you cares? can join us on EA Sports for that match. Okay. Uh, who cares about Arsenal, man? It's so irrelevant in this Spurs game now. soon be moving into a new stadium to increase their revenue streams. They want to go there with a strong side. And they're trying to add to their strength here. Around 40 million is the figure I keep on seeing. So interesting to see if that will actually oh. engineer a move. Just need one more goal. One more goal to end this game off, that's all. We've had an hour gone here, and there's still 30 minutes left. Boom sauce, are you joking? And it wouldn't be on this channel anyway, Kenny. Johnny van der Beek. Portsmouth have possession again. Manchester City, piling men forward. It's time for the Alamo, by the looks of it. They need a goal, and they're piling everybody forward. Oh! Not really tested the goalkeeper, but sometimes oh, it's a bit too hope. easy. Oh, he made sure he not. made the save competently. Oh boy, yeah, he did, and he doesn't make too many mistakes. This lad, I said well, before about a goal at Stamford Bridge. Alan McInerney. It's a goal for right. Chelsea. 63 minutes played, one nil. Right. They're it's trying to make the most out of Hughes' career. Alan Thanks, Alan. Because they're trying to capitalise on his career. In this, in terms of controlling possession, I do think they've got to find. I don't think he's going to be one of those guys who's going to have a long box in press it already. I think he'll be tight. Oh, in trouble again. With a quick break here. Well, now they can attack, and it has to be comfortable work, really. Bit of a stretch for the goalkeeper, but never looked as though he's going to be beaten. No, bread and butter really for this lad with his talent. Only partially cleared, so there's still some problems for them. What's going on here? Bernardo Silva, wow. just over a quarter of an hour left on my watch. Striding forward purposefully. Gabriel Bosilia. It's a shot. Just throwing his body into he the might way of the Well, there's still time to hit back in this game, and they're going to try and do it with a substitute. Josh is another one. I don't think he's going to be around for long. Good interception there. He's a guy I don't think he's going to be around long either. Anthony Joshua, I just get his feeling he's not going to have a long boxing career. Not as long as we all think it wrong for Manchester City, but the scoreline tells you it has gone wrong. Those players just don't seem to have been on the same wavelength. Probing the pass. 
close enough to suggest have another go son yeah strong oh, shot off. i think the keeper saw it coming all the way though don't care two nils good enough for us but we should get a third let's hear from alan McAnally now about a goal in the chelsea game it's a goal for arsenal six minutes remain one one and we're oh, back wow. here again thanks to alan McAnally. come on get that defense together boys great work he's got it now away. counsel him let's go Time nearly up here and just throw it forward a bit to their next game. Well, Manchester City go up against West Ham United after this. Well, if they play like this, they're not going to. Shot on! The shot gets blocked. Just hold the ball up, guys. Well done. You start walking out the arena, guys. But what you're waiting for, because not got to score. I mean, they do score and they've got to score and win the game, so. He's put in the corner, not able to take full advantage of a good position. Oh. A chance to break away now on the counter. Oh. Teammates getting out of the way because they know he can dribble it here. Oh, great chance. Oh. So close, the post. Oh, what a happy goal scorer. He's found the way past the keeper once already and now he's knocked in his second. And the hat-trick <laughs> is definitely on for him. That's the end of Man City. Takes a lot of concentration, this kind of follow him. Look at him, eyes fixed firmly on the ball. Gets it all right here. Congratulations, boss. The scoreline reflects realistically the nature of the game. There's nothing false about it. Well, listen to the noise at the final whistle here. He's sending off the main event, if you like, in a match that has left the fans here pretty discontented. Well, these players, the heads dropped as soon as they had the man sent off, and uh, we've seen so many times ten men making it difficult. This Leagues apart, I'd say. Arsenal drawing 1-1 with Chelsea. Hmm, decent result for Arsenal. Just a moment of your time. Thank you for your time. You're welcome. <coughs> So, where's where we are on the table? A point now. Arsenal have no right whatsoever to be coming close to us. God, Janssen's going to get to 90 so quickly. It's a good result, isn't it? Thank you very much, I'm manager of the month. It's uh, nice to know. So we've got next Arsenal and then that game. I hope we can beat Arsenal now. Come on boys, we can do it. We can do it. Oh, that was painful to watch. <laughs> Champions League now. Quarterfinals against Lille. Yeah, Seuss is complaining now that I'm not playing him. Mm. Home to him. Let's see if we can... We'll select you after this game, son. We should beat Lille at home. Come on, guys. We... We're not interested in playing Lille. Honestly, not. We Thanks, get... guys. We're going to get started with the questions now. Uh-oh. That's all we have. I'm just going to chance this and see what's my squad. And uh, Gomez, Armada, 
the defense is not great. Shiller's fit. Arp's not fit. So Jesus can come in that game. Sagadu is not well. Bremner will come in and play. Don't like when players are not fit. In games. There we go. Focus is not fully fit. Vicente will play into the Vicentus. Um, which can play that back. Risky business. Or should I play this? Very risky business. But need to play fresh players. Need a fresh defender as well. I've got no more fresh defenders. Um, so Mitchell inside just in case. There you go. Mada. Vincent's out. And let's give. Where's my boy Jensen? Make sure he's nearby on the side. Yep. Let's just. Fingers crossed we can win this game. I don't want to read all the play, so fingers crossed we win this game. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. We can do this. I believe in you. We should beat Lille. Come on. Come on, guys. We can beat Lille. Threat. It's not a good result. 2 0 down to Lille. That was a bad move. Alright, I have to win it. I have to get three goals against Lille. Simple as that. That's not good. Not good at all. Lille are good, better side than I thought they were. Got to come out and play fast against Lille. I know. Tell me about it. Trying to juggle players and yeah, gonna be ruthless against Neil. Got to do it. Well, the gamble I took, I should have taken that gamble. Now I've got to get it right. Pick the best team possible. I've rested players. So I hope for that gamble I took, it doesn't backfire. Amade in. Everybody fit, good to go. Got a fully fit side, which is good. No, what are you doing? Where are you going? That's nice. I like Gomez, but he can't play in that game, he's not fit. sagadu has got you in. Bring her out. Matthew also got Jesus in the bench. So some things have worked out in our favour there, but... I think this has got to be playing. Can't mess around with that. She's got to come out tracks quickly and score goals. Tamori Niles. Anyone else there? Hmm. Okay. No! I did all that to fix the table around and I have got to set it all again. I hate when that happens. Any predictions for the game, guys? I've put myself in a situation I should never be in now. I should never put myself in a situation, but... Lille seem to be a good side, a lot better side than I gave Crivel. And I should have looked at the form lines. They beat Milan.
So I should have seen that and seen that as a warning sign. Ferguson. Good. No, you're not fixed. Great. Okay, we're good. Fingers crossed, guys. Press conference. I've got to talk to my players. So we're two nil down. Bienvenue à vous et merci pour votre patience. Si vous avez des questions, allez-y. Been here before. We've had these situations before, guys, and we've come through. <sighs> Why'd I put myself in this situation? A whole night waste if I don't get this right. right. Purple, make them yellow. Why'd I put myself in these situations? What up? What's the situation? Okay. Three games from the finals. Three games from the finals. Game today. But he leads the race to be top scorer in the league and considerable attention on him. Can he add to his total? We're about to find out. And hello everyone, wherever you happen to be around the world, this is the scene here in the French city of Lille. Derek oh, Ray here in the commentary today. position and I'm joined as always by Lee Dixon. Get two and goals in first half. Final second leg battle in the UEFA Champions League. It is Lille up against Portsmouth. Well, Derek, with the visitors protecting a small league, they still have a lot of work to do to secure this victory. Tremendous ball played through. Dealing with the threat that was real. Rodrigo, can they convert? Oh, masterful defending to prevent what looked like a certain goal. And so the initial 11 for Lille. Would you call it 4-5-1, Lee? Yeah, I really like this formation, Derek. 4-2-3-1, really. The two central midfield players supplying support to a three ahead of them and then a lone striker with a number 10 just behind him. Go on, that was going. Well, it's it. a constant struggle for them to get out of their own half. Well, that's very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. What are we doing? Guys, fast. Get away. Well, let's dissect the Portsmouth starting 11. And he has just veered into an offside position this time. I need you to make Armada. What are you doing? Well, you never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match winner, but this man might be a decent shout. Lee, what are you expecting no. from him? Will he finish? Well, he didn't have it quite on the target, Lee. No, it was a great opportunity. Sometimes you've got a choice. Oh, my Power God. Look who we're playing with. He should have put his laces through it. Thierry Correa. Untidy in possession. Just oh. drifted into the illegal position. Offside, in the opinion of the officials. Two of my best players they're playing against. It's for Douglas Luis. One goal will do it. One goal will get us back in this game. And offside it is. We need to score in the next five minutes, though. Seriously. We need to score in the next five minutes, boys. Wenduzi. Well, visionary passing. 
Now, will they do it from here? And he scores! Oh, this is so finely balanced now. They've got themselves a goal, but need another one to send this match into extra time. Well, it's the hardest thing to do in football, score a goal. But when it's served up on a plate like this, it looks easy. Fabulous through ball. 2-1 is the aggregate lead. Got to put it right, boys. Got to try at least to put it right. Slipshot passing. And a throw-in it's going to be. I'll take accountability for some shoddy decision-making. Matteo Guendouzi. Too good a fight. Lost, intercepted. Samaseku, Douglas Luiz. They've given. Oh, that's an interesting pass. A matter of keeping his composure. Well, the ball's oh. getting in the way there. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Almada. And he was in the right place to intercept. Defensive efficiency personified. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Oh! Cleared away. Get that pressure on, boys. Get that pressure on. Almada. It's there for him. Oh, come stop. on. Get that pressure on, boys. Get that pressure on. They're cracking. And it crossed the touch line, so it's in here. The pressure's on, right? Get the pressure on. A real oh. opening now. Oh. Come on. These players are tired, I know. Zivkovic. He continues his run. Possession changes hands. The interception Come there. Come on, good dude. See, you play some shit sometimes, for you? Let go, let go. Might be able to set up the chance. And now waiting to pounce. Shooting! A 1v1 situation, and the goalkeeper does his job. Really good experience there. Picked his time. Really good save. Well, a sloppy clearance. What can the opposition do with this? Rog. Shot attempted. Well, that's fine goalkeeping. Real concentration. And now the delivery. Just a quick reminder, we have more action from the Premier League coming your way. It's Portsmouth taking on Leicester City. Nobody cares. Yeah, that looks a great match up, Nobody doesn't cares. it? Looking forward. So, the whistle then. We're up the half. <sighs> okay. The Arp is knackered. But if he is, we take him straight off. Right, Arp. Our mother's knackered. Okay. Gomez, who can play? Okay. When you come here, Zeus, when you do fit, he's gonna play that attacking mid for me. Gomez, you're gonna have to come in and do a job for me tonight. And Vincent, since you're gonna come off, essentially, I'm gonna need you today. Second and decisive leg of this Champions League quarter final, and the second half begins. Gabriel Jesus now. Tackling and winning the ball to boot. Sivkovic. And here's Cunha. Come on, guys. Cunha's dangerous. It's with Douglas Luis. Oh! And he takes it on. Well, body in the way. Fine reaction from the keeper. Yeah, it looked like a good opportunity, to be fair. But the keeper was more than equal to it. So you've got to be careful, Samaseku. boys. Samaseku. Yusuf Yazici with it. Get that keeper. He had a bit of work to do in getting to that through ball, the goalkeeper. Come on, boys. Get on that one. Well, you've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. Got to get the ball, boys. Come on. And Torres on the ball. And the cross is very much on. Ah. It did take a touch on the way through, hence a corner. They will now make use now. of the substitutes bench. Watch that ball, boys. Well done. Happy, the keeper. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. 
No. Go. Sight. Not a goal, Gattuso. Let your man go. Let your man go. Real chance. Well, he. Well, they can say a big thank you to the goalkeeper. That was God, inspirational. God, God, God. Well, that's as good as a goal at the other end. Brilliant save from the keeper. Fist on ball. Gabriel Jesus. And a goal it is. And what a significant one. They're locked together again. He just can't divide these two teams. An extra time, a real possibility. Well, it's good build up, and there's one player standing in front of the goal, and it falls to him, and he's not going to miss from there. Now, well, let's go back to the goal that was scored. Not meant to again. Well, it's 2 2 on aggregate here. One more goal, does it, guys? We know that. We need that third goal. We need them to mess up in midfield for us. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not no. forcing it. Not to be in terms of the cross there. Goal kick coming up. Good stuff. Get that third goal, boys. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. Musonda. Yes, defence. Yazici. On the attacking options appear plentiful. The hold the line. Hold to, that's it. To go. His Let him go. And showing fine vision. And now can he keep calm? Can't miss, surely. And there's the goal they really wanted for security. Wonderful chance of progressing now. <sighs> Chance to revisit the goal. Come on, boys, get out fourth goal now. Well, plenty of goals if you look at the aggregate. 3 2 here. And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. From one side of the pitch to the other. Resting those players was a good thing. Well, a sloppy clearance. What can the opposition do with this? Marco Asensio. Boom. Need to get stronger then, Jesus. He's shooting yours. Samaseku. We need, third goal. we need another goal to end Cunha. this. Kill. We need another goal to kill this game off, I'm telling and you. I know what these teams are like. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Go on. And the counter attack is on. There you go. Options available. Yep. A real opening now. And that's a fine stop. Now the delivery and a half baked clearance. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. Oh, you've got to hit that ball better, guys. I don't care who you are, you've got to hit that ball back, put the ball back in that. Come on. The keeper's given it away inexcusably. Well, a long range effort, but just wide. Hold it, boys. Hold it. Hold it. You know how dangerous these teams are late. We've seen it too many times in these Champions League games. Hold on to it. Good. Matteo Guendouzi. Go on, son. He's broken free. Giving it a try. What a save it was to keep them in with a shout. Well, they actually kept them in the game. If that goes in, it's all over. Played into the centre of the box. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Given the position he was in, he's not going to be especially pleased with himself. Well, he took the chance with power. Not always the best option. Let the whistle go. Just let the whistle go. The longer they take, the better it is for us. Get on that ball. Excellent work. Go on, Rodrigo. And that is all. The final whistle has sounded... And that makes it official. They're through to the next round. Well, you have to say, Derek, over the two legs, they probably deserve to go through. Doesn't get much closer than that in the end. They'll be growing in confidence the way they play.
That's what we need tonight. It's got to be the Champions League tonight, guys. We've got to get that Champions League tonight. Too much pain. That that Real Madrid beating that loss was a bad loss. They knew the penalties, but it was bad. Just couldn't have that happen to us again, guys. While you're in the room, please smash the like button. The more likes and the more comments you leave in the comment section after these matches, it's great. It helps us. It's only Lille. Mate, we play Paris Saint-Germain. What the hell are you talking Merci about? Pour votre pour répondre à nos questions. Oh, mate, it was only Paris Saint-Germain we beat before that. It was only Man City we beat before that. You do talk, well, you, awful, you do talk some awful shit sometimes, I tell you, you Joshua. You do talk some shit. You do talk some shit, I swear, honestly. Voilà. Sometimes you've got to call people for shit talking they put out, and that was just easy to be called out. Right, what have we got next to deal with now? What's our next challenge? Calendar. What is that there? To be confirmed, Champions League. So, Emirates Cup. No. It's only Man United. It's only Arsenal. Oh my God! No. No, 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 no. Why are we playing Liverpool in the semi-finals? Well, they're going to have to get smashed then. Simple as. They're going to have to get smashed. It's as simple as that. If if Liverpool in the semi Keep on us in the real world. The real world of scepticism. Man United in the semi-finals. Like, I don't care, really. I mean, what do you prefer? I think we rest our players. I don't think we rest our players. What do you prefer? A semi-finals with players not fit? I'm flipping hell. I don't care. We just play a second-rate team against Man, I mean, Man United in a cup game. Cup we've already won here. It's, that's exactly what I'm doing. Peterson. Yeah. Murder out. Where's his name? If we were to beat Man United with a second-rate team, that'd be amazing. There we go. Play that right inside for us. Um, a Ferreira. Average Man United, easy game, that's it. That's it, son. Where's all my defenders? I've got no defenders. Zagadu's out. Oh, could talk. Great time for you to get injured, mate. Really great time to get injured. Thanks. Cheers. Twat's got injured. Got himself injured. Twat's got himself injured. Great. Um, Richard, who's going left back? Richard, play left back. What? There you go. Zagadu. Who's Ferguson? Can he play right back? No. So another player we've got here can play left back. Mm. Rose, can he play left? No, he can't play. Well, Bells has to play them. Got to do something. We're gonna we're gonna get actually pulverized by Man United. Quatwat, yeah, I know. Well, who's gonna play up front? I guess it has to be Jensen or Jesus. Mm, take a chance and play Jensen up front, and then put them out and play all my youngsters. Gallo in. If there's in this hope that I, by me resting all these players, bringing all these youngsters in, that we, <clears throat> it also has been a, it's been a good move. I hope. I've always been a big believer that when we go to these Champions League games previously, our players have not been fit. So we need a bunch of youth players. Tomorrow we shouldn't even be playing this game either, to be honest. But. If we win this game, I will celebrate our side so well, so much. Great if Jensen went there to go to press conference. Try and boost them as much as I can. 
Thank you for your patience. We'll start taking questions now. Question to Keith. Katie rather well. I'm sure of it. Well, I don't know. I, I hope we win this game. Thank you. <sighs> ah, potential management role. Netherlands. I'm not interested. Well, Ecuador might be interested. I don't even look at this game. I just hope I've won this game. If we lose, then... They... Yes! And Peters gets the goal for us as well, which is the youth player. We made it to the finals. Yes! It's only Man United, mate. It's just average. Ooh. Keeping it real, innit? Told you. So what's gonna happen? Hey, Mystic, Mystic Joshua. Yes, Tim. What's up, man? Mystic Joshua. What's gonna happen now, son? Liverpool versus Portsmouth. What's gonna happen? The final will be between. It's either us, and Liverpool against Bevic, Leverkusen or Bayern. Mystic Femi. Yeah, Mystic Femi. What's gonna happen? You know, fifty. If you're spending fifty percent of your time doing a fitness training and you're doing fifty percent of your time doing boxing. What does that mean? It, equal, it means you're not spending 100% of the time doing one thing, right, Mystic Mystic Femi? So if you could tell us what what's necessary, that would be great. Come on, Mystic, tell us what's going to happen here. Guys have had enough time to rest, so... I really want to give it to a really 100% boxing all the time. Not according to your, uh, not according to your namesake, mate. We need to put a performance on against Liverpool. Connor or Cowboy? It's Connor fighting tonight. I wouldn't be surprised if Connor got his ass kicked tonight. I, I really wouldn't. I really wouldn't be surprised if Connor got his ass kicked tonight. But seriously. Oh, next week. Okay. I wouldn't be surprised if he... I expect him to get beat by anybody now, to be honest. I really. Yeah, well, so did David Hay look sharp. Uh, anyone can look sharp until they get hit on the chin. So, I don't know. Okay, well I don't know, I don't know that much about MMA to comment, but... Yeah, exactly. I'm more interested in seeing John Jones fight, fight a heavyweight. That's what interests me, I want to see John Jones fight a heavyweight. That'd be amazing. And if anybody should cross over from MMA into boxing, it should be John Jones. Love to see him do it. On the best possible squad against Liverpool. No messing around. But make the Nas. Yeah, you can go there. Ferguson out. And I want to put on a performance. Oh, that guy's dangerous. That guy's a beast. That guy's an absolute beast. Got a goalkeeper back yet? Nope. I think the captain should be up. This is it. We are one step away, or two steps, three steps away, two steps away from the final. But I think that's a pretty strong squad. <laughs> we've got, remember we've got Nori was just about eighty. Wow. 
Can't believe we're having to play at Liverpool. Thank though. you for your patience. We'll start taking questions now. Okay, I think that's everything. Be interesting to see. I'd, I'd still like. I'd still love to see it. Still love to see it. Semi-final time, boys. Here we go, gentlemen. Liverpool win here. Now, because you said that. Because you said that. And don't be telling me afterwards, oh, yeah. Um, I just wanted to motivate you. Yeah? Oh, I just said it because I wanted to motivate you. Pri yeah. John Johns, I do like him. I do like him. Maybe because he looks a lot like my friend who's a basketball player. I think you might see him as well. He's on my uh, uh -oh. he's on my uh, he's on my uh, bas he's on my basketball Zaire Taylor. You look at him. He looks a bit like John Johns. Let's do this. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. This is when it really gets tense. Only four teams remain in the biggest club competition in the world. And we're not far away from kickoff in the first leg. Let's bang Stay tuned. Up. We'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Tonight, if we win the Champions League, I'm leaving Portsmouth. And if we win the league, I'm definitely in Portsmouth. Bang the evening, up. This is without question one of the true cathedrals of football. Anfield, the venue tonight. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary hold tight, is people, hold is tight. Lee Dixon. And tonight we've got the semi-final of the Champions League coming up for you. It is Liverpool up against Portsmouth. Yeah, thanks, Derek. I'm so so excited for the players. I really am. I love playing in semi-finals. Didn't play in the Champions League semi-final, Mike. But you find out about yourself in a semi-final. Can you control your emotions? Can you commit to the game plan? We're just about to find out. Very, very excited. The Portsmouth starting 11. And underway now in this Champions League semi final first leg. It's with Vinicius Junior. And possession lost, intercepted. Rafael Leao. Bruno Tabata, Lozano, 
Excellent defending. Jan Peter Arp. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Now he must favour the cross. Oh! The keeper completely untroubled. The opportunity was there, boy. You've got to take those opportunities. God, I can't doubt yourself. Palacios. Hold your lines. Wait for Liverpool. And give it away. That's something. Beautifully disguised ball. Just drifted into the illegal position. Offside, in the opinion of the officials. There's gaps there, guys. There's gaps. There's gaps in Liverpool's defence. Going to be disappointed with that pass. All right. Promising sequence. Wait for them. Wait for them. Wait for them, and then counter hard. A chance to whip it wait. Well, and go. To get it away properly. Oh, come on. Go. Go on. Oh, you got to bend the art, man. Clear runway for art. Clear runway. Lozano. attack clear for, clear runway Gomez. for art come on clear runway clear runway in the gap in the gap my goodness the importance of getting there was not lost on the keeper and Marge, you got to do better mate some of you guys have got to pull your finger out your ass tonight man the gaps are there Bruno Tabata Go make force them to make mistakes and then counter their mistakes. This attack looks highly promising. And go. Lovely. Wait. Go on, have a go. Oh. I'm just waiting. Wait again. Wait. Wait. Fabinho. Bruno Tabata. It's with Irving Lozano. No! Time to play it over. Wait. Wait. Into the advanced Wait. Position. Terrific block there. Counters on. Go. Bremer. Go Amana. on. Go on. Are they going to forge ahead? A fairly routine for any goalkeeper. So the corner played into the box. Not really the ideal clearance. Well, the header, but a comfortable save for the goalkeeper. Yeah, he has to do better than that. I could have saved that, Derek. Vinicius Junior. A very high degree of difficulty for any goalkeeper. Sheer quality. Quality of the shot and certainly quality of the save. Punched away. Lozano now. Lozano. Rafael Leao. Ezequiel Palacios. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. Crossing opportunity. He's given it straight to the opposition. We've had and slipped through beautifully. And nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. Liverpool have given it away. Is it going to end up being productive for them? No more time left. First half is over. Here and left winger and the guy for the middle. The left winger and the guy for the middle are full of shit. They're not producing for me today. Let's have a look at them. Vincentus, Amada, Gomez. All right. Let's change something up slightly. All right, Amada. Just want a little bit more pace in midfield. Uh, Armada. He's alright. I just need some pace in that midfield. Who've got a midfield? Incentus. Mm, Essential. Let's go to the left wing. Okay. Now what about the solidity in the field? 
Yeah, let's go with that. Just for the first half a second. Second half of this Champions League semi final first right. leg underway. Oh. Yeah, Almada. Bring Rog into the side, bring the Rog has it. Things a bit more solid in midfield. Matteo Guendouzi. This is Rog in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Must score! And up for grabs off the keeper. Rog. And putting his body on the line. Untidy in possession. Well, I just wondered to myself how important that save will be come the end of the game. Really important goalkeeping to keep. You know what time is, the time is now. There's no time better than now. It has to be done. Yep. You need to be coming on now. And you need to be coming down as well. Yep. Enough of the playing round. We need Good to get a goal. Square, wasn't it? Get that ball off as soon as possible. Fabinho now. Moving the ball nicely. Looking for that final pass. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Pretty routine there for right, the good goalkeeper. Good kick, but boot right off the field to the can. He was one of the better players in the first half, but needed to be better still. Lee, your thoughts? Great work, great work. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Left side and, and through middle. Let's go. Marco Asensio. Yeah, I'll bring you on side, fresh inside of it. Dan Axel Zagadou. And it's with Maitland Niles. He's got the right idea with that pass. Oh, a vital interception. All right, guys. Andrew Robertson. Got to test this keeper in more. The now. Palacios. I'm delighted to say more Premier League action coming up for you here on EA TV. It's Liverpool facing Manchester City. And he takes it on. And that's easy peasy for the keeper. And a friendly reminder that we have more action from the Premier League coming up. It's Portsmouth facing Aston Villa. Yeah, the fix is coming thick and fast. Should be a good game, that. Though hopefully that's not the commentator's curse. All right. Almada. Gabriel Jesus. Oh, close. So, 20 minutes to go. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Here's Robertson. He has plenty of support. Counters on, boys. This is what we're good at best. This is what we're best at. Delightful pass. This is it. Just couldn't capitalise there. Gabriel Jesus. We wondered if a goal was forthcoming, but it has arrived now. Well, finally, the deadlock has been broken. Not long to go now. How will that affect the opposition? Told you we're like Nigel Ben on the counter. Well, let's see that again. Once he gets into his stride, he just strolls past players. What a lovely solo, wonderful effort this is. A chance to revisit the goal. The most dangerous on the counter. That's how I set my team's up. Inside the last quarter of an hour. Another goal will end the Liverpool now, I'm telling you. I'm telling you boys, one more goal ends Liverpool. Palacios. It's with Irving Lozano. It's with Fabinho. Lozano. Possession and patience, the watchwords. Gabriel Jesus now. Rodrigo. Gabriel Jesus. That's a very impressive piece of defending. Can these Liverpool players respond to this amazing energy from the fans? No, they can't. Electric in here right now, urging their team on as the clock ticks. An important interception. Oh, come on. Let it go. Yeah, let him have a go. Matteo Guendouzi. Oh, and very Guendouzi deftly to... cut out. Listen to that noise. They're urging their Liverpool players on. Using space on the opposite flank now. Just 
drifted into the illegal position offside in the opinion of the officials and a substitution in the offing tremendous intuition to win it back tremendous ball played through Gabriel Jesus pretty fruitful position Oh, that was a terrific stop in a one-versus-one one situation. Well, high fives all round for the goalkeeper. Absolutely fantastic. In a corner like that, every goalkeeper's dream, really. And there goes the final whistle. It's a victory for the visitors in the first leg of this tie. Well, to be honest with you, Derek, after the first leg in a semi-final, I'd take any advantage. It is a small one, not comfortable. It, we just need to good they didn't come chance much have many chances of scoring which is good well done boys just need to keep them in confidence uh, just a moment of your time plans yeah um, no further questions Clearly, if we win the Champions League tonight, I'll spend a little bit more time playing some uh, other, some, what should we call it? Hold on. We have to be Aston Villa a second. It must be Aston Villa. Who's injured? Oh, okay. The goalkeeper. Um, not, not, I'm not sure yet. Yeah, I think, I agree with you. Definitely. This challenge is starting to do my nut. I just want to get to the end of this challenge. Also, it says here, win the FA Cup. So we're through to the finals of the FA Cup. Uh, I've got to win the Premiership. A uh, squad now. I've got to switch the squad around again. Rest players. I need everyone rested. So far, I've risked the players and I've brought players in, and they seem to have all done a good job for me. I could do that. Um, I'm really proud of Peters. He came and did a fantastic job for us. Peters and Rog. Those two played together in midfield. Sentian on the left. No, we've got no left winger apart from Sentian. No, we don't. So then we're going to have to play off Sentian then and left hand side. Left back. Let Mitchell do left back. And then the defender. Oh. Where's Bell? Yeah, I'll have to go in defence first, mate. No, it's not ideal, but. Okay. Down right hand side. Rodrigo. Don't really play you down right hand side either. Got right hand side to play? Yeah, we've got Ferreira. Let Ferreira play down right hand side for us. And up front. Well, you could play Jesus. Or we could play Janssen. Where's Janssen? Yeah. Collado, we can play Collado. Don't need him to play Let's play Collado. There you are. And then... A bunch of youngsters can be played then. This out. Nori out. For... Spears in. There we go. Peters. For... Aaron's don't need his Jesus plane, we certainly don't need the other Jesus plane. Gomez out. As you can see I'm just trying to rest as many of our players as possible. Get Gallows in, take Jesus out. Yep. But the other has his company plane either, so might bring him on trans no I keep him on just in case I need to change some striker. Yes. Let's hope we can win this game. We need to win this game against Villa. Please guys, please beat Villa, please beat Villa, please beat Villa, please beat Villa, please beat Villa. But Schiller score for us, please. Come on, please beat Villa. Yeah, we need that. Who scored? But Schiller scored for us. 
But she just scored two goals for us. Well done. That's good to know. Keeps us in the race, and I hope Arsenal draw with men. God. Janssen's still improving. Look at Richard Janssen. Vers good. They're all improving. And it's given us one, two, three, three, three days, three, three or four days for our guys to recover. Man. So everyone should be fit and ready to go. There should be no excuses whatsoever. Everyone should be flying as well. Everyone's got to play some serious football, which I'm happy of. I couldn't be happy with my side. Because everyone is playing their part to If we win this title, it's because it was a team effort rather than one guy scoring all goals all the time there we go rug out sorry rug mate i know you played well for us but it's Gunduzi and gomez are going to have this game Gunduzi are close to 90 now which is good there's Gunduzi. i love Gunduzi. we do Rodrigo's a silent assassin, man. People don't talk much about Rodrigo. I think he's a brilliant player. Since he can go on the bench. Peters is a good player. Bremen is a very good defender as well. We'll have him on the bench. No, actually, I'm starting with Bremner. I want the fitness. My player's fit for this game. Tomorrow he can sit on the bench. Just in case we need an extra defender. Wilson out. Bushiller in. Collado. In, fears out. Rock. Then Ferguson can go in there. Yeah, we have it. Backup goalkeeper, do we? Never mind. Both our goalkeepers are injured. A pain in the ass that is. Only one man should be captain if he's playing. That's that man. Right, this is it, boys. Liverpool will be coming flying at us for sure. Okay, thank you for your patience. We'll start taking questions now. We're going to win. In front of our fans. Um. Wow, Portsmouth. The ground is going to be packed for the semi-finals. Absolutely packed. We're one step away from being in the finals. I wonder what our stadium is going to be like. I would love to hear what the crowd is going to be cheering like as well. The atmosphere is going to be amazing. I'm sure, guys. And ladies, ladies and gentlemen, it better be a sellout. Oh, come on, I need to practice one of these, these long shots, scoring from long range. Well, not today, I'm going to be practicing. Look at that stadium. Should get upgrade after oh, this. It's a great privilege to be here on the south coast, in particular at Fratton Park. I'm Derek Ray, ready to bring you commentary, and joining me is the former Arsenal defender Lee Dixon. And Liverpool know full well they have a lot of work to do in the second and decisive leg of this Champions League semi final. It's Portsmouth taking on Liverpool. Yeah, thanks, Derek. Liverpool with plenty of work to do after that first leg. Thanks, Derek. It's on a knife edge this game, isn't it? Behind after that first leg defeat, but only just. This could go either way, it really could. Getting the opener tonight could decide the tie for me.
to dissect the Portsmouth starting 11. Till I die, I'm Portsmouth till I die. I know I am, I'm sure I am, I'm Portsmouth till I die. Portsmouth till I die. Let's take a look at the Liverpool starting 11. Well, as a team, they do have their stylistic preference, and it really is all about trying to put the opposition under pressure, making sure that they don't compose themselves. Lee, do you expect to see more of that in this game? Yeah, pretty much. They love to press high, don't they? It's their He's got to score! Oh, it's off the post! And turned out of play, so it will be a throw-in. Fast start, fast start, fast start. He's had to go for it. Wins fast the start. Got to start fast in this, guys. Got to start fast. Don't give him breathing space. Well, you never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match oh. winner, but this man might be a decent shout. Lee, what are you expecting from him? Well, as soon as you start putting the ball in the net, three goals in the last three games, that breeds confidence. And when you've got a player that sharp in front of goal, he's a huge asset to the team. Yeah. Fabinho now. Wait, guys, wait, wait, wait. Dele Alli. Just wait. Ezequiel Palacios. Wait, wait. Be patient. And then break fast. Patient enough build up. Can they carve out a chance? It's there for him. Pretty routine there for the goalkeeper. Almada. Oh, Almada got the ball. Right on top of the situation to get the ball. Oh, sloppy stuff, guys. Good technique displayed. Powerful enough, but not precise enough. No, not accurate enough at all. He had other options on as well. A sloppy pass. Come on, guys. Started well. Robertson. He has plenty of support. Let's do wait. Robertson. Wait. Rodrigo. Matteo Guendouzi. Bodies forward and the break looks on. And now Rodrigo. Come on, Rodrigo. Deli Ali. Lozano. It did look as though it was rather a fruitful avenue, but nothing doing. A pass better than that. It's with Irving Lozano. On the ball, Rafael Leal. Fabinho. Tremendous block. Routine, really. enjoying space others to play it to well it's one thing to win firing it towards goal easy meet for the goalkeeper this has got to do better ball, Rafael Leal. Oh. looking confident with the ball at his feet plenty of players waiting in the middle terrific block there the offside flag had to go up Nice. Yeah, it's got look to be more. Line. Look along the line. Zagadou. Almada. Gomez. Piece of shit on this too. It's with Fabinho. I'm not sure about Gomez in this game. Possession changes hands. The interception there. Come on. And dispossessed. A foul it most certainly was. Free kick given. Matteo Guendouzi. Almada. And now Rodrigo. Great opportunity. Can they put it away? The referee has indicated there will be a minimum of two minutes. Deli Ali now. That's an important intervention. 
Now the managers will now deliver their half. Nah, that's what it is. Gomez on Armada. I knew it was something worth feeding, right? Got back here where you belong, Gomez. Back there. Hmm, Gomez can come off. No, we've got else playing midfield. No, I don't know. Big 45. Um, yeah, we need a right back in. Tidied up that area up there. Hmm. Gomez. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. The big 45. What's the big 45? They're underway in the oh. second half of this oh. Champions League semi final. Big 45 minutes league. left. I know. A goal will do it now. This is Varan. From us. Anasios on the ball. Bruno Tabata. It needs an accurate cross. A decisive clearance it was. Rafael Varan, Andrew okay. Robertson, Fabinho now. Well, still searching for the equaliser, but not passing it anxiously. Bruno Tabata, and the decision is one of offside here. All right, boys. Let's try and keep a hold of this ball a little longer. Nice. I'm delighted to say more Premier League action coming no. up for you here on EA TV. Oh. It's Portsmouth facing Crystal Palace. No! Running towards goal. Must score. That's Come it. The keeper. You obviously don't want to play Champions League football, right? right place to intercept. A Wake chance up. to whip it in. And he's beaten him here. Cross right. blocked. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. Come on. Robertson. It's got to be! Now, let's stop. Go! Well, we always enjoy bringing Go you live on. action on EA TV and Premier League action coming up. It's Liverpool facing Aston Villa. Come on, yeah, come on, ref. In a cracker there. Both teams will have a real go at each other, I'm sure. It's got to be a penalty, ref. Okay. Now nah, it's time to take some play off. Um, we need to freshen this side up somehow. Right, Jesus. Alright. Up. Mm. We need to be through the middle. But Schiller, can you come in and come through the middle for me? I know you're not fully fit, but you can do a job for me. Up. I want you to come off. And Peters. It's Rog. Peters. Rog. Okay, gum is off. Oh, okay, never mind. Between Bushilla and Jesus. Bushilla is the man who gets the three balls. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Ezequiel Palacios. Palacios. It is a decent looking attack here. Tremendous ball played through. An attempt like that, never likely to trouble the keeper. No, he's got positioning right, but it was a poor shot in the end. I don't think he's got too bad than that. It's with Fabinho. Rafael Leao. Ezequiel Palacios. Fabinho now. Dele Alli. And that was a very fine read. And breaking at pace with Menis. Well, an example of a counter attack that went nowhere. Fortune to make the stakes, boys. Gabriel Jesus now, and very deftly cut out. Ah. They're forcing to make mistakes, boys. And here they Bruno come again. Tabata. It's a highly promising Liverpool attack, but will there be an end product? 
smuggled away. Sustained pressure, and now they have the ball. Let's go wide. Now. Let's go wide, boys. Possession changes hands. Wide, the wide. There. Oh. Good technique displayed. And Mohamed Salah now. And options in the centre. Salah. Can they get in behind them? No, and that is out to block. Now Mo Salah. Palacios. No, no, no. Well, he'd be disappointed if he didn't take that one cleanly. And five minutes to go. Robertson. Uber Makana. Wait. Here's Robertson. For the mistake. Wait for the mistake. We're going to try some adventures again. Let's wait for them. Alley now. It's with Fabinho. Wait for the mistake. Robertson. This is what I'm talking about. Wait for the mistake, I said. The electronic board has been held aloft. Two additional minutes here. I don't think the goalkeeper will be the slightest bit bothered by that effort. Well, he won't want to watch that on the replay, I tell you. He was way, way wide there. Hold on, guys, hold on. The referee's whistle, and it is official. The hosts are going to the final. Well, Derek, semi-finals can be nervy, nervy affairs. There's no difference with this one. There's a massive prize around the corner. You do anything, you fight tooth and nail to get into that final. They've done that tonight, and you have to say they deserve it. I'm Paul's first tell I die. I know I am, I'm sure I am, I'm pausing till I die. Pause first till I die. Good technique display. Sick boys. The defence were good for us. The defence was much better than it used to be. That's sweet. One step away from being Champions League, cha being Champions of Europe. One step away. One step away. Just a moment of your time. Ups and downs, we have them all. Chuffy's asked to claim. Maybe to win all our matches. Thank you so much for your time. You're welcome. So we're in the final of the FA Cup. We are literally one point behind Man City if we win against Crystal Palace. We've got to win against Crystal Palace. I'm going to play the same team. I'm not going to mess around with this. Yeah, look, Rose can go for the loan. Yep, you can go. We've got to beat Crystal Palace. Simple as that. We cannot draw against Palace. We must win. I've got a good team out there. Well done, boys. Is ahead in the end of season. Almada, Tamori, Ellen, all of them, boys. Just got to keep winning. Keep the pressure on City. Keep training. I know. Tell me about it. Trained, I've trained for the enemy now, so two points. How's the two points between us and them? There's one point between us. Liverpool again? Oh. We beat Liverpool again, then I think. We're home to Liverpool. Um, as I say. Okay. Welcome, everyone. We'll be starting with the questions now. They keep talking to the side. See, it. we just got to be okay. Liverpool again. I'm not playing it. I'm simming it. And if we lose, we lose. We're just not good enough. It's as simple as that. Now, we've got to be good enough. Draw. Not good enough. Still lacking something as a squad. Not stressing myself over it. 
98 to 101. Whew. Last game of the season. We're not going to win the league, but second, which is something that we. Okay. We'll play you in this game, mate. I sense the you're playing. We'll play you. The deuces out. Played the wrong plays in the wrong positions. My fault. On my mind. Bushilla. Seuss play up front. Sensia play on the left. Tomorrow back in defence. Oh. What else could I have done? The twat's legit. Twat's legit. Gomez, a state. Where's Rog? He plays in midfield with Collado. Marder out. Here comes Aaron's. Out. Divis in. Mitchell in. Ori out. Ferguson in. Nathan Mars out. What else? Well, I'm not going to win the league, but I can't do everything. Uh, let's just try and get as close as we can. Hope Man City drops points. We're still not quite the complete. Um, yeah, Nansen for a year. Mm, no, yeah, because we didn't re re use him in the Champions League. So, yeah, go to Napoli for a year. Go and learn to football at Napoli. Yeah, go and learn as well. Oh, come on, beat Everton. We'll get three points and just. Well done boys, here you go, Bushilla, Jesus, well done. We come second in the league, which is a shame, but the mandate was for us to win. I don't want to play Spurs in the final, I really don't. I, mean, I want to win the FA Cup, but Spurs, come on man. Spurs, who wants to watch us play Spurs, Not me honestly? Honestly, he wants to see us watch Spurs. I don't want to see us play against Spurs. I'm not waste money against Spurs. Get the best team out there against Spurs. Um, okay. It tells you how well the other teams have been this season, isn't it? Man City played very well. Yeah. Man City played well. We just need to be better next season. There's only so much we can do as a squad. I think we just got to keep working. Okay, well, let's go beat Spurs in the cup final. I don't want to watch the cup final against Spurs. Honestly, I don't. Let's get this squad together. Get the best team together for against Spurs. Make sure they get beat, and we all can rest happily at night knowing that we beat Spurs. Uh, I think so. If I, if I, yeah, I think I'll lose it in season. I mean, we'd like to win the champions. I'd like to win the um, premiership, but I'm not gonna push for that anymore. Maybe I can win a premiership in another league. Maybe next season I could be Premier League champion, but maybe not. You know what I mean? It's like that now. I mean, we seasons I try to be win the Premier, <laughs> Premier League. I think for me, if we win the Champions League, it's a great result. Um, new challenge somewhere else. I don't think it's a bad thing.
all these players though that we've, we've got here now. It's just a shame that some of these players I've built here. Yeah, best in Europe here. Yeah. Some of these players I've got here are not even... Ah, uh, never mind. Mate, up, Captain. I just don't... I just want to beat Spurs and be out of it. And can focus on the Champions League final. I don't manage you chasing Spurs. In, in. Come on. Thanks for joining us, guys. We'll start questions now. Good chance we'll win. It's a hard to get here, so. Okay, guys. I don't know. I just hope we beat Spurs. That's all I care. Beat Spurs. Come on, boys. Let's beat Spurs. That's good enough for me. Rodrigo scored two goals against Spurs and Harry Kane didn't score. That's good enough for me. Donkey Kane didn't score. And we got the FA Cup. Mission accomplished here. So that's one mission accomplished. Now, buying in the final. So, champions of the FA Cup. Portson said, great work. Why is it, let's see what they're saying. Just wanted to thank you for reaching, to reach one of our grand exposure, brand exposure goals that we set out to accomplish the season. We wanted to earn 342,000, or million, sorry, through media exp earnings within three seasons, and we couldn't have done it without you. Well, I did it, did I? So we're good, we're happy with it now. All happy. Did that long term. Did that, did that. Let's see, youth development, high. Sign you two youth players in youth season, and in the same season, they were scouted, played them at 12 matches, or as part of the sub, or in 11 matches, 11 eligible. Growth three had youth guys by 10 players overall. I haven't done that yet, I'm going to get on to doing it medium. We're in Premier League title, we had one that became second. Win the Champions League. I'm sure we'd be happy if we won the Champions League. I mean, a lot of people would be happy if we won the Champions League, to be honest. So let's go win the Champions League. Before we do that, let's uh, where's Joshua? He's gone quiet, he's probably gone bed night nights. So, player of the tournament was Cruella. I'll have to buy him then. Cruella, oh, I've still got a World Cup coming up here for England. Oh boy. Final. <sighs> one more, one more step for the night, boys. A final against Bayern Munich. What more could you ask for, gentlemen? Saturday night in in Champions League football. The young, the sort out dream was always really. It wasn't about us becoming Premier League champions. It was more about us becoming champions of Europe. And if we can do that in this game, I think it's mission accomplished. First Champions League final I've ever played in. press conference this would be amazing thanks guys good to see you here we'll get started with the questions now should I wear the same shirt for Champions League okay, final no I don't I think I should wear a pink shirt for the Champions League final I, I, I'm fed up looking the same way all the time and I've got to be confident and I think we should have a flipping. I think I, sh I think I should wear a pink shirt. Of course, in in the night and glory. But I think I should. I think I should have a new. I think I should have an inner top. I, sh I think I should wear inner top. Should be pink. Let's see what I got. Yeah. And um, and that jacket. I'll change that jacket. I haven't seen that damn jacket all the time. 
I think a nice cream jacket would be nice. Let's see this one. Mm. Mm, maybe. Mm, yeah, maybe. No. Mm. No. 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 Mm, maybe. Yeah, I think I'll wear that for the files. Yep. Actually. Yeah. Representing the club. Go away the jacket and I. Well, I proudly walk the squad out for the finals. Can't get off. I can't seem to get a light blue one in there. I'd love to, but I can't get a light blue one in it. Club top. Jacket. There we go. End of this season, regardless, it's time to move on. Final season with Portsmouth. Let's do it the Mourinho way. Get to the Champions League final and win. <sighs> Been a good, good run at Portsmouth. Every year we've won something. European Super Cup. Yeah, I think so. When the journey begins, you never quite know who's going to be there at the end. Now only two teams left in the cup, and we're left wondering who's going to be lifting it. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Be nice to work with a club that's there unknown. There is nothing more prestigious than this. We await this year's UEFA Champions League final here at the magnificent Metropolitano Stadium in the Spanish capital, Madrid. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined for commentary as always on these occasions by the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. Wow. It's up against Bayern Munich. Wow. Well, hundreds of millions of people will be tuning into this one. Probably the biggest club game in the world. Pointed end of the tournament. Who's going to come out on top? Well, Derek, we're just about to find out. Very, very exciting. Always difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game, but you could make a strong case for this man. Lee, what are you anticipating seeing from him? Well, yeah, Brace in his last game, he'll certainly be a threat. Can he get another two goals or even three in this game? It is the game that the world truly focuses on. The Champions League final. Only two teams left in the quest for European glory. Who's it going to be tonight, Lee? Well, it's a toss of a coin for me. It's a really big night for everybody. All that hard work leading up to pre-season training, going through your domestic league, playing Champions League on and off, the winter break, all of that culminates in tonight. Very, very big night for everybody concerned. Supporters, but most so the players. They have to stay focused, play the game, not the occasion. Renduzzi, Vinicius Jr. And it's a quality pass. And a powerful effort, but just lacking accuracy. Yeah, narrowly wide, Derek. Decent effort, he smashed it. And let's dissect the Portsmouth starting 11. Well, here is the Bayern side. It's the impressive Paul Lopez between the posts. Yeah, he's a good goalkeeper. Mtiti starts with Milan Striniar in central defence. Oh, Saul starts defenders. with Artur in central midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. 
read it superbly to take back possession. Much of the pre-matched. A real opening now. Can't miss, surely. It's in. The first goal of the Champions League final. Oh, it's a fantastic moment. What a moment for the players. And what a moment for those supporters. is again Derek the way to the pass is excellent and the finish clinical lovely play 1-0 then Kieran Tierney Otto has it Jan Peter Ark Oh, surely. And putting his body on the line. Matteo Guendouzi. And they will be awarded a free kick for that. Oh. Off. That could well off. be his off. final warning. Off. He's off. got to tread off. carefully from here on in. Well, he has, yeah, but it's quite easy for the referees to throw yellow cards around willy nilly, but not on this occasion. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. It needs an accurate cross. Guendouzi. Gomez. Great challenge, he got nothing but ball. Tierney. Good vision, can he get onto this? On and on he goes. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Intense pressure. And he stopped them in their tracks. Space and time for the cross. Well, great read there to intercept. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. He's in with a chance. And the post coming to the goalkeeper's aid. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Gnabry with it. Well, Derek, you, me, and everybody in this ground thought that one was in. It was so close. Woodwork saved him. And very deftly cut out. Regained possession. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Take some progress. And fed forwards. Fairly routine for any goalkeeper. He's driven in the corner. Well, it has come to nothing. And inability to keep hold of the ball there. <laughs> Byron moving the ball around and getting deep into opposition territory. Byron have been controlling possession. However, after that, the coach would dis... And a goal! And what an important goal in the grand scheme of things! Well, it's the sort of determination and desire that's got them here. All the momentum is with them now. Well, I want to see this one again, and there it is. I wonder how he gets so much power from that position, but he really does. It's a brilliant, brilliant effort. A chance that to again? revisit the goal. Oh, flipping hell. Well, of course. Even Steven won a piece on this match. I think he'll be coming next season. I'll be, wherever I go, he'll be coming next season. No, not today, though. Well, he was just a fraction offside then. Not That's today. That's all he needs to be, a fraction. And it was so close. Not today, I don't care. Not today, not today. Over the touchline for a throw in. Not today, not today. Not today. Tell you, not today. It's a slide draw pass. That move looked as though it had genuine potential, but it's broken down. Not today. Not today. Gomez. And now Rodrigo. It might be on for them. 
It's got to be. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Now the delivery. Thunder's clear. He has time to play it over. I oh, just couldn't keep the ball. Half time then, and we're sorry for the pause. Forty-five minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. No pressure, Jerry, of course. Tierney. Skriniar. Saul. Gnabry with it. Saul. Oh. What the... Pass not finding its target. Staunch. Archer! Good stop from the keeper. A chance here perhaps to invigorate their aerial targets. It's a short one. And crossed in the direction of the back post. And up for grabs off the keeper. It had an invitation attached, but he couldn't avail himself of the opportunity. Well, just look at him. He thinks he's in just wide. Well, we always like a good transfer rumour, and this actually appears to be more than a rumour. Lee, what's your take? And he's made head Fine goalkeeping, real concentration. It'll be a corner. And you need your defender to take charge. And it's, can they take the lead here? Going for power there, but just too much elevation on the short lead. Yeah, over the bar, Derek, with pace. He's a little unlucky. Well, look at the stats. Very, very close. What do you do? Do you keep what you've got? Or to go for the spoils. The ball with Maya. Maya. It's with Saul. Samuel Intiti. And 30 minutes left for play in this match. Given away. He has teammates to play it to. Artur, dangerous looking attack, just too close to the goalkeeper in the end wasn't it? Yeah, poor technique really and the goalkeeper's not troubled. The offside flag had to go up and it did. Yeah, look along the line, look along the line. It's a substitution for Bayer. Maya. They've given it away. Kieran Tierney. Now Eder Meritao. Gabriel Jesus. The shot wasn't really far enough away from the goalkeeper, was it? No, but he picked up the flight nice and early. Artur has it. Giving the ball to the opposition that time. And 
incisive pass. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Is he capable of sparking something? Well, the attack promising as it was. Scuppered there. And breaking at pace with Menace. Oh, shoot. Excellent ball over the top. A real opening now. Not all that hard to deal with crosses like that. Come on, boys. I need you. I need somebody in this game to do something. Tim, it's got to go out here. Got to keep the ball a bit better than that. Come on. Come on, this is where I need to get a goal. Block him. An awful lot of green space to run into. Crossing opportunity. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Oh, tremendous vision. Oh, shit. Electing to cross into the centre. And in for Bayern. With time running out in the Champions League decider. Well, Derek keeps a good delivery into the box. But you have to question the defending there. They simply don't react quickly enough. The goal again, albeit from a different angle. Well, the coach can feel this game slipping away, I'm sure. Might need a plan B. <sighs> well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. And just the one minute left in normal time here. And attempting the through ball, just straying offside. Might be able to set up the chance. Terrific block. Another goal from this corner would in all likelihood secure a victory. Little variation on the usual theme, short. The goalkeeper was called upon, and they still have an opportunity here. Well, there's a goal down. Oh. And the final whistle, the cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. And, Lee, memories are being made. Yeah, absolutely. It doesn't matter how much money you've got in the bank. Players will always look back at moments like these. These moments where you pick trophies up and win medals. Absolutely brilliant for this group of players. Yep, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. A club steeped in European tradition. They always expect to land silverware. But my goodness, this is always special. The coveted trophy awaits. Well, they've been a team, Derek. They really have that togetherness. Let's put them on that podium. Bayern Munich lift the trophy. <laughs> A night for wild celebrations now. No two ways about that. And this is really special, getting to celebrate in front of your own fans. <laughs> well, it's giving something back. These fans have travelled all over the place following their team. Now they get to join in the celebrations, go into the crowd and give them the cup. That's what I say. Well, then it might never find its way to the trophy cabinet, Lee. For the history books, Bayern Munich are the club champions of Europe. A real opening now. Can't miss, surely. It's in the first goal of.
the Champions League final. Oh, it's a fantastic moment. What a moment for the... Decent progress with the ball at his feet. Fairly routine for any goalkeeper. Bayern have been controlling possession. However, after that, the coach will be disappointed. And a goal! And what an important goal in the grand scheme of things! Well, it's the sort of determination and desire that's got... That was a great goal. The first goal was a great goal. But the second one... Look at this save. It's got to be! And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. That goalkeeper is amazing. The second season I've come across this guy has been brilliant. Not finding its target. Artur! Good stop from the keeper. Well, a chance here perhaps to invigorate their aerial targets. Look at this. And he's made headway. Well, that's fine goalkeeping. Real concentration. It'll be a corner. Can they take the lead here? Going for power there, but just too much elevation on the short lead. Yeah, over the bar, Derek, with pace. He's a... Things across into the centre. And in for Bayern, with time running out in the Champions League decider. Two wonder goals. The first goal was a blinder, and the second goal, both the times the goals were scored. What a time for Katwat to go and get injured, eh? What a time for Katwat to get injured. Just a couple of questions for you. Yes. We're a strong team. Uh, we faced a stronger team. They were just a better team, and that was. Thank you. Congratulations to Bayern Munich. They played very well, and if it's two wonder goals that put us out the cup, then I mean, what can you say? We're not we're clearly not the finished. We're clearly not the finished article as a team. Second in the league, I mean. We'll have to see, see what jobs are available now. Um, see what jobs are available for me. Liverpool job, Man City, Spurs, Bayern Munich. Well, they've won the Champions League, I'm not going to go there. Leverkusen, Liverpool. Leverkusen is the only job that's open at the moment. We'll, we'll have a look and see. Maybe end of season things will change. Close to the end of season might be other jobs. Yeah, there might be some Italian jobs, but I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, I will do. Boschilia and Orens. Well, where's Boschilia? Well, Otoir, an idiot. What a time for you to go and get injured. Carl's Bashilia now. Um he's 79, 30, 79. Um now I think we should just renew his contract. But he doesn't want to also renew his contract, so let's kill to him. Those guys don't want to renew their contract, that's their business. Like not my interest anymore, just to you know. All those young players we've got, all the time I've spent building those young players up. Feels heart, I feel heartless leaving the club now, but I know I've got to leave, so.
we're not on track. We mean not on track with youth development. We are on track with our youth development. We're talking about idiot. I don't want to be at any other club. I don't want to be going to. Be nice to go to a big club, but I don't want to be going to a big club like Man United or. Let's see what this is available. Okay, let's see what we've got here. Um, I hope there's jobs, you know, because I don't want to advance and not have any jobs. Can't believe that after all the work I put in, after all that work I put in to get us to the Champions League final. You think there'll be any jobs in the summer, Joey, for me? I didn't even confirm I'm going to stay at Portsmouth yet. I can't stay at Portsmouth for another season. That was just heartbreaking. It really was. That was heartbreaking. That first header was amazing, but the second one. Yeah, it was it was a wonder goal. That's all you can say. It's called it's just a wonder goal. The first goal was a wonder goal. The second goal was a wonder goal. I don't know where to put my head. I don't know how we didn't win the Premiership. I don't know how we didn't win the Champions League. I do have an idea. The goalkeeper we had wasn't as good as... The goalkeeper that was injured. That's the first thing. Should I really be carrying guys like Rock into a Champions League final? I don't know. Good night, Cameron. I don't even know what time it is. What time is it, mate? I'm gutted. I'm absolutely gutted. I. I say two a.m. There's boxing on tonight. Joe Hart, Hart is playing. Um, um, Smith is fighting tonight. Smith and Hart are fighting tonight. Light heavyweight division. Joe Smith and Jesse Hart. Good fight. Pretty good fight. Yeah, you'd think some seconds would take place. Mind you, if we lost the Champions League and, and we won the World Cup, I'd be happy. Never won a European Cup, a, a Euro Cup. Yep, Spike Sullen's going to get flattened. He's only in it for the money. He's going to get absolutely flattened. Let's see what, uh, 10, 11, 11 minutes, we'll take that. Let's see if there's any jumps about. Hundred ninety five million transfer to careers. See jobs. Oh my god, no job up with this. You know what? You know what I'm gonna do this season? Mess around this season, I'm gonna go straight away. Um
mess around this season. I'm bringing a world class midfielder in and a world class striker in, and I'm not messing around. And I'm not going to sim it right to the end of the season. The deuce is cool. Mitchell. So maybe Mitchell should have played in that final. There should be nobody under 80 in this squad now. believe that uh, I believe that performance right Love to sign you. Would sign you. 83 as a striker, 26. Play up them ballet. Job it. Pedro. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Yeah, well. The discussion about bringing him to the club would have been nice. It would be worth signing. He'd definitely sign worth signing. a world-class midfielder on my side central midfielder three of them put them in we could defend an attack be nice good defender in midfield Baba, hmm. Foden. Deli Alley. Hmm. With eighty eight. Hmm. The goods. Pugue, did we sign Pugue before? I'm sure we signed Pugue before on our side. Savage, good player midfield. 
do a great job for us. Cromwell. Goreska. Always signed him in the past. I want to make a statement, Morgan. I want to make a statement this season, you know what I mean? I'll make a real big statement. 31. I want to make a statement show, yeah, you know what? We are very serious this season. I'm going to try and wood pass before, but... Chowdhury. 28. Yeah, Hala needs to go in it. It's got to a point where... Um... Got to that point where it's got to happen here. He might be the guy that will uh, help us win the league. He's, I think he's about thirty though. though. He, oh, he's twenty-five. Yeah. How much is he worth? One hundred twenty-one million release, mate. You're joking, aren't you? Okay, well, we're going to go for him. We're going for him, and I'm going to... No. I'm not paying 120 million as a release clause, so I'm not going to pay 70 million for him. I'm offering 70 million for Haaland. Hi. Start with seventy million. Come on, guys. Hey, we're talking about ninety one million. Talk about ninety five million then. I'll offer you ninety five. Let's go ninety five, come on man. Great. Ninety five million. We're paying ninety five million for a striker which we've got to use more regularly. I don't even notice what his weekly wage what is his weekly wage anyway. His weekly match for about two fifty, three hundred thousand. We got the money for him. Sporadic. Yeah, all right, fine. Five-year contract. Okay. Well, I've got no choice to state upon people. What I'm just going to do is just. Go right through it. I'm gonna, just, I'm gonna just buy a couple of players for the squad, and I'm gonna leave them in the squad, just to, strengthen our midfield. I'm gonna sell Rog. Yep. I'm gonna be absolutely brutal. Like some brutal stuff is gonna happen now with the squad. Let me surround them all because. We've heard, well, it's good to put, I need any, need a, um, goalkeeper in. Right, some players going to have to go. Starting with, you're okay, you're fine. I know we're going to renew our contract now, yep. I'm holidaying most of it, mate. I'm just clicking holiday and see if we can get through to half the season. Um. You're going now, mate. I'm sorry. Rog's gone. But I think you're up to task. 18.65. Yeah, you're going, mate. I'm sending some of these guys have got to go. 16. Exciting prospect. On loan you go. Peter's good player. Improving. You're in 70, 75, 75. Martins is brilliant.
the first 20 minutes. Gomez is alright. Remove him from the transfer list. Clunts, um, he's alright. Pereira, 22, 76. No, he kind of... 87, 30 years old. Is it time to be letting go of you? I don't know. I do to transfer this. Since this is brilliant. Smith Rowe, 25, 82. Mm, he's got to improve Smith Rowe. He really has this season. Great player. He's improving. Vega, what a player. What a player. Rodrigo, world's blessed. Cano. Consasal. He's going to Napoli this season. Gomez. Jesus. Yep, he's got to do something special this season. Now you need to renew your contract. Yep. Yeah, definitely. But I'm not going to stick around. Um, if there's other jobs to take, I'm taking them, mate. I'm not messing around here. You must think I'm crazy staying in this club. I'll put... Oh, there's a World Cup probably on now as well. Everybody can train now. We'll train them. Um, Good, you're all training, let's see. Got the youngsters training. Maybe if the goalkeeper in. I'm gonna just go I'm just gonna see what I can do. In terms of sell on fee payment received, okay. Never seen that ever happen before. La Font, okay. 2.35 million we got for that. Chat. See if we can push the season on a bit. I think it's World Cup time, might be. All these players are playing World Cup. Um, I don't even know if they can manage anymore. Alright, uh, let's go now. So we can get another top defender in for the club. Um, quality is sitting back. Six four six five hey, 28. Conta. Robin. Uh, so we can get. Cosa twenty eight million as well. Hmm. Harry Maguire. Forget John Stones. You'll do though. Thirty year old. 
class defender. John Goers. Yeah, 29. You're all sight. We'll sign him. What the hell? You get Gomez in. We good. Strength up defence a bit more. And then we get another goalkeeper in. Oh shit. Oh boy. And well, we go to season. Calendar. Wait, shall we get my squad first? And then the players that uh, Helen's in there. She's the top players and not in there, Vega. back and that looks into the fit well here we go we've got Richard now he can get he can put back and still Mitchell which has improved at all there we go let's get the left back we had where is he where is he? Is that the back I had? Is that the back go? Oh well. We didn't even left back while we didn't go and go. Check my score quickly. Yeah, he went in goals, see? Let's go, keeper. Right here, yeah. Let's push on with this now. Get to Christmas. We are wherever we are by Christmas. Yeah. Wherever we are by Christmas, we are. If I'm sacked by Christmas, I'm sacked by Christmas. Enough players inside now to. Let's just. There we are. Put this through now. Let it go through.
comes with loot. in the cup and cup mm. just want to say that mm, snicker bar Ice creams are the best. They're better than normal snicker bars. If you've never had a snicker ice cream, be careful if you're allergic to peanuts, keep away from them. But otherwise, very good. You need to. <coughs> you don't know what you're missing. Don't look like we're in any cup, does it? We thought we'd be knocked out of cups. There you go. Thank you. I sincerely hope that we got through to the next round of Champions League. <laughs> or November. It would be a shame to... Yeah. There's no cup game for us. Obviously we've got knocked out the cup. <coughs> now... I'm confident we're still in the Champions League. Come on, Portsmouth might be a top side now. I've done enough building with them now not to be a top side. Come on, I've got faith in my Portsmouth side. Second in the league. Second in the league. Look at the goalkeepers injured. Don't you believe this. We need Couture back inside. Who is this? Who is Couture? There he is. Couture's inside. He's back in defence. Since he is out as well, he's not fit. Players are not fit. Not good. Sensio, fifty two million for Sensio. At this point of his career. You can have him, but for more money than that now, 75 to 80 million, yeah, and I'll strengthen that left midfield position. Listen.
Cool. That's cool. Since it was 73.1%. That's pretty that's a brilliant, brilliant deal there. That means the new man that will slip in his role is the new Messi. You get that? Do you guys get that or do you not get that? So he'll come out now. And the Vega can play down left and the right. The new Messi. And then we can look to buy another winger in. You see that? And we need to get another goalkeeper in as well. So we'll get another goalkeeper in. And we'll buy another winger in. Oh shoot. Yeah, so he'll come out. The new Messi comes in here. We'll drop him out. Um, you need to back in the squad quick time. Rich has been playing in that position where you shouldn't really be playing. There. players improving. Rog's got to leave as well. He's moving 80 to 79 now. It's not good. That's why he definitely has got to leave the club now. Let me just see that sale go through. I need that sale to go through. Right, let's sale go through and I'm really going to invest. Now, you ready? Okay. Lady sounds like Melissa. Okay, what are doing now? All right. New world class players in any position. Okay. Goalkeeper. Ramsdale, six foot two. Allison. Don Ruma, forty six to four million. Yeah, I guess he would be the Stegen. Leno. Don would be the guy to get. Yep. The world's best goalkeepers in the club. Why not? And then when we go to get him, let's get him and then see if we can trade him with one of our own players. And try and buy him with one of our own players. I think 92 as a goalkeeper is pretty good. Try and sell one of our goalkeepers.
missing that man. No ramping. Class goalkeeper. Don't think we need. Oh, it's a cup game. Mm, okay. Come on, guys, push on, push on. Second league slate, bad. Guys, since we've seen so much now that we've well, improved this year a lot. Windows opened. <coughs> the room is in gold now. Ninety two million, twenty one, good. I want a world class uh, defender and winger. Yeah. Just make sure we score them goals we need to score. Right, he's the old oh, Marshall. Love to have him on the left hand side though. Sterling, 32. No, I won't go with that. We need a guy maximum. He's not bad. 86, not bad. Harry Kane. Don't be silly. Carvons, 26 million. 83. OD, 57 million. Good pace. Very good pace. I think it's club. Rashford, love to sign him. Oh, look at this guy, Castillo. Well, I'm buying him as well. Beast down the left hand side, look out. Ball control. East Nelson's pretty decent as well down the right hand side. We need another set back as well. Set it already. And the work class set back. Bally, I'd sign him. Love Bally. For 15 million.
Set back. He's decent at back actually. Can we number him? I can get cheaper than that. Go for 25 million. Just need a bit more experience at back, that's all. Make sure that if we have a deal with the at the back, we've got another guy that can cover. Ethos. Try and get him for 40 mil, 42, 42 million. Be a great signing. I did that was a stupid move. Apart from his more established player. Stupid move. Never mind. Good. Great. Name your price for him, name your price. Bro, that's sorted. Glad we got that sorted. Work with what we got. Simple as that. now so Odie's in there as well now so that's good let's push this game on there man get to the end of the month yes get past Derby we've got to play Arsenal play Arsenal I think the semi-finals we're playing Arsenal in there I hope that's not Champions League if it is I won't be happy Champions League as well, I think so now. Champions League only, only resumes in the prime February, right? No, it's not Champions League. A semi finals of the FA Cup of the League Cup. Probably because of Carabao Cup. Play Arsenal three times in the space of look, one, three cup games we're playing Arsenal in. Cup there, cup there, cup there. Wow. Three cup games have we played Arsenal in. Ridiculous. Hope by having Don Aruma as our goalkeeper has helped.
three points in it. That's of last season. Go six man. boys done let's see what we've got next mm. Ferguson Nathan Ferguson who's Nathan Ferguson this must be one of our new players. Oh yeah, right back. No chance. No chance. We've been building him up. Mitchell. Five million. Mm, Thirty. Yeah, you can go. I think. For Cano, yeah, Cano can go on. Could do something going nowhere. This is off limits. Got to play a chapter second, see what's going on with players. Please go online, you two guys. Nope, Ferguson's going nowhere. Oh, the else is going nowhere, so that's it. Yeah, no else is going anywhere. Good. Finish. That's going with the squad now. Medium. Sanda, who's next? Champions League. That's against Monaco as well. Arsenal again? My god. Let's see if we can beat Monaco. We really don't want to see us play anyway in Champions League games unless it's necessary. Here we go. We well, you now qualified. You now qualified, so let's put the squad together. Art, Rodrigo, Amanda, Dizzy, Gomez. Let's hope we win this game, please, guys. They've been playing good football as well. So, come on, Portsmouth. Oh, when he comes and gets a goal for us. To be fair, the guy that should be scoring goals, four more goals for us is uh, the other guy we should be out in front. To make Gomez into a superstar. But, uh, 
Don't worry, Mr. Gum, you should be alright. Made against Saxon, I tell you. Probably just get a bit better. What's his problem? Why does he want to submit a transfer? Well, he's been in Egypt. Up, oh, he's been in Egypt, so maybe he's playing too much football, I don't know. He's been a bit in Egypt, so it's alright. If he wants to leave the club, we sort that problem out, no problem. Bang, that solves that problem. And whoever wants to play, I'm going to play after that. Um, Let's play striking and get some goals for us. I'll score more goals now after this. I'm interested in Chile. Let's keep going. Let's see how we do against Ar um, Arsenal. If you can score the sort of goals you scored against me, you should beat Arsenal easy. Haaland getting the goal. Well done. Got attacked quite well in the end. Us against Port Everton in the final. Come on guys, let's win this cup now. Just the Belgium job either. It's in the damn game with no press conference. Press conference, just win this game, man. Hallam get a goal for us and win the game for us. Well done. Hallam got a goal, two goals. Since as well, that's it. League Cup champions. Call on corners, 11 million. Uh, calendar. The next, oh, if we can beat Monaco, please beat Monaco, please beat Monaco, please beat Monaco. Begging you to beat Monaco. Make my life so much easier. The League Cup, that's the first win of the season, good win of the season for us. So we keep it going. More medal trophies continue to come into the club. Come on. So now we've got to bed soon, so what time is it? Three o'clock. Camera must be nicely tucked in bed now.
to be around the league. Point in behind, we can win. The, we can go on the win the league, boy. This way, we can win the league. Yeah, I'm gonna hit the sack myself. I'm trying to just get to the. Ninety-seven percent as a striker. Damn. I've been ninety-nine striker yet. Table, baby, top of the table. Might win the league this year as well. Do we get past Monaco in the Champions League? We'll soon find out. No, we did. Now we've got Barcelona in the quarterfinals, and I don't know. <laughs> Might not do it, and then might do it. Quarters, cool, semis. Right, for the squad. I must play up front. Not hard. Well, defence is a problem. Problem is not injured. I thought I was going to play there. Great stuff. Great to focus on complaining that role. Uh, I don't play that. I don't want to play up. I think I'm at High Helen up front. I know Hannah's done well so far. Come on. Let's beat. Let's go beat Barca, guys. Thank you for your patience. We'll start taking questions now. Okay. Please guys beat Barcelona, please beat them. Shit. Didn't need that. Who scored? Up. Oh, who scored? Oh, okay, okay. I'm gonna be chasing this game, but if we get knocked out Champions League now, I really don't care. Got to that point now. Get to the end of the season. We end up in the league if we do well here. Helen's out for two months, see? Look at that. Yeah, Helen's out now, see? See how this game works? Game's a piece of work this game is, I tell you. Hope we can get first the next round of Bar against Barcelona. Let's play the most powerful side we got. I hope we can win. With a fresher squad than we had last time. Haaland's out. Let's get this team together. 
Okay, Vega. This is. Oh, is it 88? This is night 3. Gasp the game, gasp up the game. Simple as that. Can we call a victory away from home? I'm not playing this. If we can, let's go tell our team to be confident that we can. We've done it before. Las preguntas comenzarán enseguida. Gracias por su paciencia. Come on, we can do this, guys. Se ha acabado el tiempo. We can do this. We can do it. I'm not watching it anyway. If it's a problem. Who's injured? That's a problem. Oh, Haaland's injured, of course. I can't forget. We lose, we lose at this point. We'll even end this season, end off. Yes! Well done, boys. We are through to the semi finals, it looks like. There might still be a chance for us, I think. Decide who we're playing in the finals. Oh, Valencia in the semi finals. Wow. <coughs> Here we go again. Should be looking at what we're doing in the Premiership to us. April. Okay, let's have a look. So, kind of where are we in the table? She wants to know where we're in the table. Where are we in the table? Oh, well, who cares? Look at the squad going into the Champions League semi finals. There you go, and Sintas. Oh, defenders out, man. Shit. How many defenders have we got? We should have a defender out here. Resting. Right now. Fitter player playing in midfield, so I'd like a fitter player playing defence as well. But let's do as we do. I hope we do well. Come on, guys, we can do this. If we get beaten in the semi finals, we get beaten in the semi finals. At this point, just gotta believe in yourself. Las preguntas comenzarán enseguida. Gracias por su paciencia.
Valencia, come on. We've got to beat Valencia, guys. Come on, we're a better team than Valencia. We're a better team than Valencia. Come on, come on, boys. We're a better team than Valencia. That's what I'm talking about. We are a better team than Valencia. Come on. One more game away from the Champions League final. Backing you boys all the time. Come on. Oh, we might just win the league as well if we do right here. It's on a knife edge. He's injured. Nori's out. Left back. Yep. Let's bring Gomez back into his life. Come on, guys. Go win this game. When he gets Fulham is good. Keeps us in the race. Beautiful. That's the way we've got to be playing games with teams that's Fulham. Come on, come on, come on. I oh, know you'll be progressing, so don't worry. Hopefully we get our full team ready for the final. Semi-final at least. Tomorrow wants a new contract. We'll do that now. Get to his contract as soon as possible. Two more races, give me a new contract. Five in two months. Mm. Yeah. He's gone to Juventus now tomorrow. What's all that? Okay, Champions League, hope we're fit now, let's use let's get data go. Yeah. Pick the best players to play in that who we got now. Who's not fit, who's fit? Like the fence needs changing, we can adjust that now. Absolutely now, Gordon. Brennan in. Wrong coming back. You know those guys there for his brain. Um, yeah, bring 90, got to keep your left back. Nice and fresh there. It's fair because I'm fit. It's not fit than that was. Okay. It's quick and foggy. Come on, guys, we owe it to ourselves. 
Champions League final. We've got the players for it. We can do it. Come to far again. Okay, welcome everyone. Uh, we'll start with the questions now, please. Thank you. Okay, bus. we are out of time, unfortunately, so we're going to wrap up. So thank come you, this, everyone, for coming. Can't come this far, boys. Cannot come this far and not get to the finals of the Champions League. Can't come this far. Come on. You're a good enough team. Come on. Yes. Don't tell me we're not good enough. <sighs> well done. Now. Don't tell me we can't win this damn league now. Come on, don't tell me we can't win this league now, come on. Well done. Don't tell me we can't win this league. Two of the games left of the season. Man City's the team, ain't it? We're the team that could up, up, upset everything. If we're going to win anything, we have to beat Man City, the former champions. Okay, welcome everyone. We'll be starting with the questions now. We can do this. We can do this. Come on. Come on. Just got to beat Man City today. Yes. We're playing like champions, boys. One game left. Liverpool needs to slip up. Oh, God. Who we playing last game of the season? In this game, we actually become champions. We can become champions today if we win this game. We need a defender though. All our defenders are out. It's a shame. Concentrate. Win this game tonight, and we could be crowned champions of the Premiership. Win the next game, we be crowned champions of Europe. Wow! Simple as that, guys. Got to score big against them as well. I think the last game we got to win big. Yeah, here we go again, Joey. It's not in their own hands. They must win and hope results elsewhere go in their favour to be crowned champions. The action is live. 
I don't care well, how it was it a comes. great privilege to be here on the south coast, in particular at Fratton Park. I'm Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by Lee Dixon. And today could well be the day when the league title is clinched. It's Portsmouth, and they take on Bristol City. Oh, thank you, Derek. I was speaking to some fans ahead of this game, and they're in buoyant mood. You'd expect them so. They're a little bit nervous as well. Can they push their team over the line? I'll tell you what, there's going to be some incredible scenes here if they do. Last game of the season. Would it be great for us to win the league here? Well, let's dissect the Portsmouth starting 11. Can they trouble the... It has to be! Goalkeeping of the very highest order. Oh, it was a great shot as well. Great shot, great save. Maitland Niles. Tactically quite clear what they're doing. Trying to get right on top of their opponents. Getting news of a goal in the Liverpool match, Alan. It's a goal for Liverpool. Four minutes played, 1-0. Well, I'm not sure if you were able to hear the gasps among the crowd, but word certainly starting to spread about the goal in the other match. As it stands, they would narrowly miss out on the title. Well, you just wonder whether that message has got down to the players. It can be so distracting if it has. Very important you keep your focus on the job in hand, getting the result here. Great challenge, he got nothing but ball. Gomez. And they switch to an even higher gear. It's got to be! It's not really close to worrying the scoreboard operator. No, it's worth a try though, but when he looks at the position he is in, he'll be disappointed he didn't hit the target. He really is danger personified, but in this game, Lee, what do you think we might see from him? Well, how do you stop him? Four goals in three games. I suggest the defenders, not just one of them. Twos and threes might be the case. Almada. Can he finish this? Well, that's an awful finish, and the goalkeeper could do nothing but hang on to it. Easy save for the keeper. Absolutely terrible finishing from the attacker. And news of a goal in the Fulham match. Let's hear about it from Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Fulham. 20 minutes played, 1-1. Alan McAnally keeping us right up to date. And providing width. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. Safe pair of hands, did his job. And now Rodrigo. Almada. My goodness, it looked as though he was clean through. And the referee, what will he do here? And the official had no option but to reach for the red card. He decided it was a goal-scoring opportunity denied, Lee. Absolutely. No decision to be made, Rick. Will he finish? Tremendous block. He's given us away. And he's broken free. Wonderful block. Surely. And tipping it up on the crossbar. Well, the players have to use this noise to their advantage, Derek. The opposition are really under the cost. Well, a sloppy clearance. What can the opposition do with this? They've given it away. Adam Nudge. He must finish! And putting his body on the line. And now Rodrigo. Let's go to Alan McAnally because there's been a goal in the Spurs match. It's the second goal for Tottenham Hotspur. 38 minutes played. 2-1. Thanks as ever for the update, Alan. Baldwin. Given away. Well, that is a defender's job to come to the rescue. A good-looking move, but a shocking pass, really. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. Opportunity to take the lead. And this time, it's in. 
Well, the offside flag has been raised. No goal. Well, it was close, but he just went a little bit too early. They've regained possession. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. He cuts it back. Well, can they convert? And up for grabs off the keeper. Well, there goes the half-time whistle, and the news is not especially good. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Now just couldn't keep the ball. Moving the ball forward with purpose. It has to be. And he's kept it down. Fully stretched. Somehow reaching it. Played into the center of the box. Well, the header, but a comfortable save for the goalkeeper. Yeah, he has to do better than that. I could have saved that, Derek. Let's get an update from Goodison Park where there's been a goal. Alan McAnally can tell us about it. It's the second goal for Everton. 49 minutes played. 2-1. Alan McAnally keeping us right up to date. Untidy in possession. Well, quite rightly, all roads lead to Wembley on FA Cup final day. And showing fine vision. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Oh, a goal! And that changes things profoundly. As it stands, they will be champions. Oh, just look at the celebrations. It's unbelievable. I'm absolutely loving this. As we can see, right place at the right time. Striker's instinct is to be there and thereabouts. Keeper is no chance. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. Getting news of a goal in the Liverpool match, Alan. It's a third goal for Liverpool. 59 minutes played, 3-0. Thanks, Mark. And he's broken free. Gabriel Jesus. And the goal. And surely that's one hand on the title. Oh, how important could that be? Just look at the fans. They're going absolutely crazy. Well, look at it again. I do question the defenders, but let's give credit to him. What a wonderful solo effort. And he still has the presence of mind to finish it off. What a brilliant solo goal. So, 2-0 now. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. Possession lost, intercepted. Not much time left in this season, but they hold the cards to win the title. Well, good vision from Gabriel Jesus. Still alive. Can they hit on the break? And the counter attack came to nothing. Great challenge, he got nothing but ball. And news of a goal in the Bournemouth match. Let's hear about it from Alan. It's a third goal for Bournemouth. 70 minutes played, 3-0. Thanks as ever for the update, Alan. Can't miss, surely! It really is such a free-scoring performance. 
Just nothing the defenders can do about it, seemingly. Well, it's good play. Ian Wright always told me, stand in the middle of the goal. It sounds simple, but you don't have to get a lot of goals from that position. Now, let's go back to the goal that was scored. Well, sadly, we have to conclude that this hasn't really been a contest, but all credit to any side committed to scoring goals like this. Gabriel Jesus thunders clear well now I think the fans know they're going to be celebrating a title what an achievement Lee well they have been the best team in the league no mistake about that they played with such a set and it might be and the keeper there to make sure nothing untoward happened Wenduzi Gomez Dangerous looking attack. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. He leaves at the end of the season and we're free. So upset about that. But who cares, I'm leaving at the end of the season. And a goal to tell you about at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium, Alan McAnally. It's another goal for Tottenham Hotspur. Six minutes remain, 4-1. Thank you, Alan McAnally. Inside the final five minutes now. Breaking at pace. Well, that break looked so promising, but... Nothing coming from it. Matteo Guendouzi. Gomez. Vinicius Jr. Might be a chance here. Almost what you might call a jaw-dropping save. Oh, he's got no right to make that save. It's absolutely fantastic. What an important piece of defending. Firing is in. An attempt like that. Never likely to trouble the keeper. No, he's got his positioning right, but it was a poor shot in the end. Brownhill and the referee has blown for full time it's official now the champions have been crowned absolutely top of the pile that's all you can do when you start off pre-season you see this moment in your mind's eye they've got their brilliant season it really has been a goal to be the best team in the league and they've hit the target well Derek there'll be definitely times this season where the form has dropped we've had injuries etc almost seems like a pipe dream so look at these moments now well, they'll celebrate long into the night I'm sure One more thing, one more final thing to do tonight. Is wrap that Champions League up tonight. What a comeback. League and Cup Champions would be amazing. Just a couple of questions. I could be more happy with them. The lads did it. That's all that matters to me. It was a great match. Thank you for your time. A bit of drama in it as well, so we did well. I'm, I'm happy. 
Now Chelsea in the final of the FA Cup. I mean, to go on and win the FA Cup as well, that'd be terrific, I think. But I mean, I don't think anyone cares about us winning the FA Cup. I think people care about us winning the Champions League. Truth be told, if we've won the FA Cup, we'd just be defending the FA Cup, to be honest. So, let's go to the office and see. Objectives. The two seasons increase the increase the fifteen percent. Okay. Let's go win that FA Cup anyway. Exactly. If we beat Chelsea in that FA Cup, it'd be brilliant. We've proven, I think, we're the best team in the league. Now, see with the retain that LA FA Cup title that would be brilliant and then from that let's go win that Champions League it belongs to us um, let's make sure we've got the right squad going in Bremner no we don't need Bremner going in that game definitely want to have our best guy in defence if possible I'm serious if anyone else in defence we can play nope we've got nobody else in defence to play really so we stick with what we got. Be happy with what we got. And just hope we can win this game. I know you'd be pretty good for, for me. Kind of press conference. Thank you for joining us. We'll start the questions now. Let's go beat Chelsea now, guys. If we okay. beat Chelsea, that'd be amazing. It would be. It will solidify us. We can go get do the triple this year if we beat Chelsea. Well done, boys. If we've done Chelsea as well, but the big game is next. Champions League final. Who are we playing in the final? Paris. Well, ironically, we're playing Paris all over again, eh? But that looks nice, doesn't it? That looks nice, doesn't it? Real nice. Real good. Yeah, look at that. Look at that, baby. Belongs to us. Joshua, one's for you, son. Yeah. All you tuning in, this is for you. Gotta make it fun. Now we need to go and beat the team that we've beaten so many times in this game. Paris. This time we score a goal early. I'm try and put the pressure on them early and get a second goal. I'm not going to make the mistakes I've made in previous Champions League games. As soon as you get a goal, try and get a second as quick as possible. We must beat Paris this game round. Final game of the season for me. After this, I want to see what jobs are available as well. I want to see what jobs are available for me. Browse jobs to see what we got. Chelsea, Everton, Liverpool, Man City, Man United, Purs, Bayern, Dortmund, Leverkusen, Wolfsburg, Germany, Germany. So Wolfsburg's a possibility. Leverkusen's a possibility. Dortmund's a possibility. So it looks like Germany might be the next place we're going. You like Dortmund, okay. Um Texas Champions David Champions League please. 
hopefully everyone's rested for the Champions League game. The United job, bloody hell. Who's got what? Man United job. I mean, how many people would have done the FIFA of Man United in it? No, no, no. Back, back, back. Yeah, we're going to get out of England. Sick and tired of being in England. It's boring. We've got to win this game. We've got to win this match, honestly. I'd like to go to France. Hi guys, or... I think we're ready for questions now. Gotta get it right. Tomorrow should be back, fit, ready to go. Bremner should be out of the squad. Anybody's not fit, just Tomori should be back in the squad. We need Tomori back in the squad. Where is he? He's in the squad. Oh dear, we need another defense. Oh, okay, I know. You can go in defense, that's cool. Uh, Nate the Master's got to play, I think. I know he's not in great form, but he's got to play. Tomorrow's not in great nick, but it'll have to be. Okay. Bring this out. Let's have Collada in the squad just in case. Anything? Shame Haaland's not fit. Trigger if he's gonna be in that sort of state. And then he can come out. And who else can play instead? Um, I guess the smartest guy to bring would be Rog. Should be last season for him. OD 88, Ferguson 83, 80, Vega 89, Jesus 89. Alright. Let's do this. No build up. I'm going straight into the game. emotional um, yes today's our day it's got to be our day come too far won everything else won the FA Cup won the Premier League can you imagine just winning triple triple title triple threat Can you imagine it? Come back from the disasters last season to come back and win the Premier Real League, excitement Champions and League. Here. A cup final about Sit. to be decided. Who will hold the trophy aloft? Stay with us. We'll have all the action for you live right here on EA TV. Has it got a bit worse? Is it? Everyone's waited up for this. This is where every top-level footballer wants to be Russian. after a long season. The Champions League final, only two teams left in the battle for Europe's Premier Club competition. My name's Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary on this final tonight by Lee Dixon. It's Paris Saint-Germain up against Portsmouth. Well, hundreds of millions of people will be tuning into this one. Probably the biggest club game in the world. Pointed end of the tournament. Who's going to come out on top? Well, Derek, we're just about to find out. Very, very excited. Yeah. Introducing the Paris Saint-Germain starters. Quite clearly, they've thrown the shackles off. Looks great with the ball, Derek. The four forwards up front. What happens when they haven't got it? The two midfield players are going to be very busy today, but maybe not as busy as the back four. And let's dissect the Portsmouth starting eleven. And they continue to advance, and a lot of options here. for any goalkeeper sheer quality quality of the shot and certainly quality of the save 
Well, this is the day, his debut forthcoming, and it's going to be interesting to see what he produces. What do you think we should expect to see from him, Lee? Well, he wants to impress Derek for sure. How does he do that? Well, by being dynamic, want the ball, demand the ball, run at the fullback, commit him, then end product, deliver. Ball with Sam Maxima. A guy that we've almost signed. Plenty of talk from the pundits coming into this game, focusing on Alex Lacazette. And the rumours have been confirmed. He's elected to end his illustrious career at the end of this campaign. A massive loss for the club, Lee. Yeah, it really is. Obviously, he's going to be missed very much here. He's a key player on the pitch and in the dressing room. No doubt they'll be looking at the transfer window ahead to try and strengthen and fill that gap he's going to leave. It is the game that the world truly focuses on. The Champions League, a real opening now. It's got to be. Keeper did his job to begin with. Well, getting right in their opponent's faces, forcing that hurried clearance, and a throw it'll be. Well, he took care of it defensively. Araujo, Matteo Guendouzi, Gomez, he's got the right idea with that pass, the end product just wasn't there, and had a play for a Paris Saint-Germain throw-in. And here's Saliba, Saint-Maxima has it, Diogo Dallo on the ball, Moise Kayan. Mbappe with it. Sir Maxima. Well, he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. They don't normally need a second invitation to give it a go on the counter. Happy to take on the shot. And good work to deny the chance. Can they forge ahead from this corner kick? Let's see. And firing it into the area. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. And they'll have to throw it back in play. Matteo Guendouzi. Will he find the net? Almost what you might call a jaw-dropping save. Oh, he's got no right to make that save. It's absolutely fantastic. Corner kick played in. And a goal kick given. Christensen Varela has it well it's a constant struggle for them to get out of their own half and you've got to try to make it a bit more difficult for your opponent than that superbly read and executed effective pressure to regain possession You've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. And there's the whistle. Half time it is. A radiant Champions League. Forty-five minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. And the ball with R. Oh, he's through here. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And 
he did what he had to do defensively. Vinicius Jr. This looks promising. Ball's gone. Possession changes hands. The interception there. You know, I don't think the goalkeeper will be the slightest bit bothered. By by that effort. Well, he won't want to watch that on the replay, I tell you. He was way, way wide there. And a substitution in the offing. Varela has it. Diogo Dallo. And a chance for him on the flank. And scope for the cross. And a harmless cross gobbled up. Half an hour remaining then. It's with Bentancur. Kayan. Araujo. De La Vega. And that's an important intervention. This is Rog, De La Vega. Beautifully weighted ball. And the pass in behind the defence. Quick thinking from the keeper. Matteo Guendouzi. Well, that's very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. Here's Rafinha. Kean. And it's a really good-looking Paris Saint-Germain attack. What will they do next? Will he play it in? And just like that, they've lost possession. And now Rodrigo. This is Rog. A real opening now. Big chance it is. And they nudge in front. Well, fabulous celebrations. They've got their noses in front, Derek. Can they stay there? Could be critical of the defending, but let's focus on the great play. Capped off with a superb, calm, calculated finish. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? 1 0 then. And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. Real Embolo. Well, total domination for PSG as far as possession is concerned. After that, it's been a little bit disappointing. Creativity in midfield is a little bit off. Certainly too slow in front of goal. Need to get wide, need to get crosses in the box. Read it magnificently and intercepted. Crossing opportunity. He's given the ball away. Mbappe! Oh, can you get your heads around this? Just when we thought it might be done and dusted, it's level again. Well, the fans were starting to think it was over. Not now. Another twist, maybe, Derek. Even Steven won a piece on this match. Oh, goodness, he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team. He continues his run. Thanks again. And options in the centre. Surely. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. Gabriel Jesus now. Running towards goal. The electronic board has been held aloft. Two additional minutes here. 
Gabriel Jesus on the attack. Is there to be late drama? They cannot be separated here, and it's on to extra time. Come on. Fight this one out, boys. We're going to win this game. We've got to win it. There is this no has more. The potential to stretch sinews and minds. Tiredness can be a factor as the first period of extra time commences. Got to come back. Got to come Avenia. back. Teammates could potentially join in. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Matteo Guendouzi. Come on, Guendouzi. You've got to do that, that mate. Ball, but not anymore. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. And the attack fades out. Come on. That's it. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Bentancourt with it. Here's Mbappe. It has to be! Goalkeeping right out of the top drawer. I cannot believe he's kept that out of the net. Absolutely amazing. A PSG corner it is, and potentially an opportunity. A case of foiling the up and punched away. <laughs> it's one corner after another at the moment. Elects to go short. The delivery. Well, the cross came over, and a real need to get rid of the ball here. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. End product or not. He's in with a chance. Well, they can say a big thank you to the goalkeeper. That was inspirational. Well, that's as good as a goal at the other end. Brilliant save from the keeper. Should he really have taken on the shot from that acute angle, Lee? You're judged by your play on the pitch, and some of that play is decision-making. And he made a poor decision there. And the first period of extra time comes to an... So many now having to play through the pain barrier. Underway in the second period of extra time. Space afforded him. Gabriel Jesus! And he's made it a brace for himself. The defender's just unable to stay with him. And he's having a field day. Let's have another look at this. He wasn't expecting the ball, but when he comes to him, he chooses early to volley him. What a finish. Disappointing for PSG to concede the goal. Now let's see if they can attack with vigor. And now it's with Embolo. William Saliba. It's with Bentancourt. And here's Saliba. Others in the vicinity. And possession lost, intercepted. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. It's with Bentancourt. Well, it's a constant struggle for them to get out of their own half. And green space galore for PSG. Accurate ball and draws the near post. Well, clattered away. Well, he's lost the ball. They all know their roles as they apply the pressure. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. PSG chasing this game. They're not out of it. Under wonderful chance. And the goalkeeper will see that as part of doing his job. Time is not on the side. This corner could help the prospects as they look for an equaliser. Corner kick played in. A punch happy goalkeeper. Yeah. And the final whistle. The cup issue is settled.
story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. And Lee, memories are being made. Yeah, absolutely. It doesn't matter how much money you've got in the bank. Players will always look back at moments like these. These yes. moments where you pick trophies up and win medals. Absolutely brilliant for this group of players. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. And they know what comes next. The presentation of the cup with the big ears. Well, you just think how many games they've played this season as well. All that's in the past now. The game that's just happened was the most important one. They're all poised. The Champions League winners. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. Cup with the big ears, as it's affectionately known. And this is the moment, Derek, sharing it with the supporters. You get a chance to take it a little bit closer to those stands, let them enjoy the experience with you, and the families are up there in the stands as well. A brilliant occasion. <laughs> well, like you, Jesse. It took fire as well as ice on the pitch. Necessary qualities. Well, they've come together in this competition as a team and they're celebrating together now, fully deserved. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. This is Rog. A real opening now. Big chance it is. And they nudge in front. Well, fabulous celebrations. They've got their noses in front, Derek. Can they stay there? Oh, he's given the ball away. when we thought it might be done and dusted it's level again it has to be goalkeeping right out of the top drawer I cannot believe he's kept that out of the net absolutely amazing a case of foiling the opposition by whatever means and punched away <laughs> it's one corner after another at the moment. End product or not, he's in with a chance. Well, they can say a big thank you to the goalkeeper. That was inspirational. Well, that's as good as a goal at the other end. Brilliant save. Space afforded him. a brace for himself the defenders just going down in history boys going down in history yep I think so let's make sure I've confirmed to be the new manager of the new club whatever club I'm going to let's get that confirmation done now because Thinker 007069. Just a couple of questions for you. Thank you. Yes. Go ahead. Such determination we had. Yeah, he's. Must keep up mentally. He's keep playing really well. Yeah, he's. He was. Gabriel Jesus so much for did the business for us. He really he was very impressive, Gabriel Jesus. And, um, well, it's 
definitely goodbye from me. Um, what more is there for me to do? We've I've done everything as I could do as a. Let me have a look at my season. I should look at my officers manage, isn't it? My career. Let's have a look at my career. And um Okay. So as a manager I've won the Champions League, the FA Cup, the Carabao Cup. And I've won the league. I've never won a manager of the year yet. I deserve to win a manager of the year. To be honest, I do deserve to be manager of the year. Um, I think that's about it for me now. I think I need to find a new club. Let's see what jobs are available. Chelsea. Everton. No chance. Liverpool. Nope. Man City. Blue Moon. Man United. No chance. Thank you very much. Spurs, never. Oh, France. Now, Lyon. I wouldn't mind going to France. Paris Saint Germain, no. Chelsea, no. Everton, no. Well, if I'm going to go anywhere, because obviously there is no, there's nowhere else to go apart from Lyon or Paris Saint Germain. I've never managed a big club. Um, Paris Saint Germain is too big. It all might be interesting. Go to Paris. Really? All Leon. Well, I've gone to Paris and everyone knows Paris Saint Germain. What? I don't know. What do you think? Leon or Paris Saint Germain? Got Mbappe and. What do you think? Paris, Leon. It's either Leon or Paris. Come on, people, make a decision for me. Leon or Paris? Leon's budget, Paris's budget is 128 million. I'd do Paris, but Leon could be a real challenge as you fight with Paris. Paris, it has to be. You said you wanted to take that job. Paris is a big job, isn't it? 66,000, well, 66,000. 63 million for pa for Leon and 120 million for Paris. For anyone to buy a bunch of players and win the league. I'm going to go with Leon because Leon league position was third. I think Leon would be a better challenge. We're going to Leon. Or we're going to apply for the job at Leon anyway. So we'll see how that happens. Works out then. Let's have a read and see. Uh, club news. Transfer news. Club news. Aha, look at that. Beautiful, beautiful. Portsmouth conquest of Europe for the first time in the club's history will see them join an elite selection of only 37 teams. We've done something not, not even Arsenal could do. Think about that for a second. We've done something that not even Arsenal could do. Win the Champions League. Whew, wow. Play a chat, that's what's going on here. Mate, these players are going to be. So, look, thank you for your interest in the available position. We at the board would like to offer you the manager position here. Let's have a look here. And just before I go and apply for the job, let's check and see if there's any other job. That's floating about. Chelsea, Everton, Liverpool, Man City, Man United. Inter Milan. Oh my God. Now Italy, Inter Milan. Milan. People wanted me to do the Milan job. Juventus. You guys wanted me to do the Milan job, so make your choice. Milan. Or Paris. I know you said... Yep.
There we go. Orlando unveiled Jones as the manager in a press conference earlier today. The move sees Jones given the task to task of resurrecting the club's fortunes to a crucial time in their recent history. It was like to be given the chance to bring the team back to glory times. So we are going to get Paris at the end of the season, I guess. Let's just see here. Let's see the Milan board and vision. I'd like to have you on board and seeing you succeed at our club for Milan. Success is not just about results and pitch. We have a brand to protect our business to grow and support it. Given Milan's identity and long-term plans, these are our main areas we want you to focus on. Expand the brand and popular the club. Domestic success, so it doesn't domestic league. Commercial success and finances. Okay. All right. Youth development. Win the Champions League in three years. Brand exposure. Win the league title. Wow. There's a lot of challenges there. Well, I think we will just save the game there. And we will call it Milan. The Portsmouth journey is over. So I think I'll save it right there. Thank you all so much everybody. The next time I come back and play this. I will be at AC Milan. Hope you're going to enjoy this new journey. Good night lads. Good night everybody. Hope you've enjoyed the stream.